Hello, everybody. Hi, hi, hi. Can you hear me? And can you kind of hear the game? I think you guys can hear the game just fine, right? Skaya, hello. Welcome to today's stream. Thank you for joining me. I am EP. <laughs> so, you can hear the BGM loud and clear? Good. Very good. All right. So, today, well, the main activity for today is the uh, Mars First Logistics stream, but I did promise that we'd be talking about something first uh, before we get into it. So, um, <laughs> time stampers, clippers, uh, be at the ready because I will be talking about my date with Kiki yesterday. <laughs> ah, yeah, I went out with Kiki yesterday. Um, for those of you who are not in the loop, if you did not see it on Twitter or hear about it on the Discord, I went out with Kiki Lockhart. <laughs> and then, wait, hang on, let me just my seat. Ugh. Let me see. Um, it was very fun, very chill. Uh, let's see, what did we do? Was I could talk, talk? I could talk about the the stuff that we did um, at, uh, at, at at with our little play date. Um, so when we first got there, we ate, we ate some good food, and then she accompanied me around, um, and like. I shopped for a bunch of different things that I wanted to get and I thought I might need around the house. How's she doing? She seems to be doing well. Yeah. And I think she had a lot of fun yesterday too. So I'm very happy about that. Um, let me see. It was really, yeah, I was like a very chill shopping date. Very, <laughs> very quaint, very domesticated kind of, kind of deal. Yeah, shopping for house stuff and also uh, shopping for ingredients for dinner because I made her pick what I'd be making for dinner yesterday. Yeah, <laughs> let me see. Um, yeah, like what was it? We like after we finished shopping for stuff for the house, like I got a few hooks um, to help me like hang up stuff. By the way, now my whiteboard is properly hanging on the wall and not behind my door where I can actually, I can now actually see it. So yeah, <laughs> um, let me see. So yeah, after we shopped for that stuff, we went and ate again. Like I treated her to merienda and then, <clears throat> oh, <laughs> I think I might have introduced her to a particularly expensive snack. <laughs> Um, cause I like getting her to try, um, all sorts of foods. Wait, you never had on the wall? I hung it, um, behind my door. Um, like, cause I didn't have any hooks to, on the wall yet. Cause I knew I was going to get them. I just didn't have them yet. <laughs> um, but, but yeah, no, that, that's fixed now. So, Merienda. So I like to get her to try a lot of different foods, see what she you know, enjoys and can still like enjoy eating because of like, you know, her sense of smell and taste, right? Um, so I brought her to like the food court area and I saw some grilled meats because, you know, she she needs to eat more meat, right? She, she always tells me how <laughs> she likes eating veggies a lot and normally doesn't eat as much meat. Um, so I was like, I saw some grilled skewers. I'm like, all right, I'll get you some yakitori and wagyu cubes. Have you ever had wagyu before, Kiki? And she's like, no. <laughs> so um, I buy it for her. And then um, let me see. So we sit down and like I let her have the first bite. And I, I tell you, the look on her face, she literally lit up when she ate the wagyu cubes. <laughs> You better wag you down, Rick. Well, I gotta cry. I'm the one paying for it, but if she gets addicted and wants to buy an eat only wagyu, that's on her. <laughs> we have wagyu, yeah. If you go to certain places, you'll be able to find them. Um, like, there is like, uh, how do you describe this? Like a sliding scale of quality of wagyu cubes specifically. Um, there's like, I would call them imitation wagyu, wagyu cubes. Like those are the kinds that are a little bit on the somewhat cheaper end. Still not of that, still not that cheap compared to most snacks, but 
like compared to like real wagyu, it's like it's it's affordable, but it doesn't really quite taste like it 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 tastes processed in a way. But I still enjoy them actually. I I like that kind of wagyu cube. Not gonna lie. And then. So it was a food wars moment. He exploded the taste of flavor and could barely contain herself. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Wagyu well, Sky, what have you done? I just like introducing her to different kinds of food, okay? We have Wagyu burgers at work. Very tasty. Ooh. There's a lot of different places you can find Wagyu here. It's just not affordable. <laughs> not a sustainable food choice. Um, and then she also tried the yakitori and I told her like try it with the with the the, the you know the grilled um, green onion on it too. It's really good. And she's like mmm mmm <laughs> and then let me see what else did I get her to try? Um, I do not remember. Um, but yeah we ate that snack and then um, I told her like, well, so, um, since I already, was, uh, uh, no, uh, what, what did I say? I don't even remember the order of stuff that we did. <laughs> I was like, well, you're going to be picking ingredients for dinner. And she's like, me? I don't know what matches with what? You want me to pick? I've never, like, I don't know what to, what you can cook. And I'm like, just pick whatever you want. Are you craving anything? Do you want me to make anything in particular? And she's like, um, uh, and I'm like, okay, let's start with an ingredient. You can either start with like a meat or a vegetable, and then we can go from there. And um, let me see. I she she said potato, <laughs> and I was like, okay, potatoes, all right. Um, we could make uh, mashed potatoes, and she's like, oh, okay, that sounds nice. And then let me see. Potato goes a lot. Yeah, it does. It's a lot of different choices. So like I started running through a list of other things that could match with it and then we settled on chicken. So um, we decided we'd make... I also got asparagus. So it's mashed potatoes, um, pan fried... We also have mushrooms. So pan fried shiitake mushrooms, asparagus, and then some salt pepper and a few herbs chicken um we didn't really have time to marinate it because we just bought it there and then you know as soon as we got to my house we had to cook it immediately <laughs> she for sure said potato shrooms and bacon not bacon but <laughs> can't go wrong with potatoes yeah oh james thank you so much for the green super chat this just in local warden lures in a locksmith and get her addicted to meat crack <laughs> damage amount to thousands of dollars <laughs> Damn, I guess I just gotta get rich to feed her more Wagyu. <laughs> um, but yeah, and then we went around a bit more, trying to see if there was anything that like she might want to buy to bring home. Like I would have covered it for her, but she's like, no, it's okay, no, it's okay. I couldn't figure out what to get her specifically, just because like, um, I feel like I haven't taken note of her palette as much yet. So, uh... <laughs> Feeding her the marble premium meats to further add to the bakery garden. <laughs> Wagyu farts on throne, Laval. Um, and let me see what else. Um, what else did we do? Uh, brain, brain trying to process it. Well, I don't think there was much after that. Um, like, eventually we went. To my place and then um we defrosted the we defrosted the chicken and while it was defrosting we ended up playing um ah trivia quest on netflix we had a little bit of netflix and chill you know <laughs> uh kiki's gonna fund them herself oh my god commander still needs her jacket funds to wait speaking of throne i did put a few things there and thank you guys for covering that thank you very very much i was going to announce it but people just got it already so thank you i i will make sure to set aside time to get through all the thank you notes uh wait let me let me go through the events in order what was even on throne throne watcher strong i put a little bit of snacky's fund i put a fund for a new mouse because this one is still double clicking a lot. And then I also put a fun for a voice shield. 
I think it's uh, basically a sound shield of sorts. You put it behind your microphone so it doesn't echo as much, yeah. They check it every day to snipe, I guess. Um, okay, so yeah, Netflix and chill. We did a lot of trivia. And then once I noticed that the chicken was done defrosting, I started cooking. So, um, uh, yeah, we boiled the potatoes, right? I let her take charge of seasoning the mashed potatoes because you know if it's just straight up potatoes it's kind of like Neh. so i gave her the ingredients that i had at home so like mayonnaise salt pepper uh we had milk um unfortunately i ran out of butter yesterday the day before um and then like she was really nervous <laughs> Uh, how is she holding up with the artist? And Mr. Stone? She's doing well, guys. She's doing all right. Um, I don't want to like mm, speak for her. She did tell me um, some nice things, but like I, I don't want to speak for exactly because I'm not entirely sure if I should be sharing those specifically, but she's doing well. Un, un, un. Yeah. So salt with potatoes, not potatoes with salt. <laughs> um, she said she gets nervous seasoning things because she feels like she's gonna add a lot. Um, hmm. Also, another reason why I don't want to say is because it's because she was very tsundere with her last letter, right? And I haven't been able to read it because I can't read by Bayan. Um, but it's. She said something very sweet about the keychains. That's all I can say. <laughs> That's all I can say. Yeah. Um, I'd rather have over season than under. Personally, I'd go with under because you can always add more afterwards, right? That's good. I've been worried about it. Don't worry. I'm making sure she's doing well and being well fed. I posted a translator on Twitter. Uh, you can share it in the Discord. I'll go check it out after the stream. Yeah. And then let me see. What else did we do? Um... Yeah, I. she was like mashing the potatoes, the fork, and she's like, Sky, I think I'm fucking this up. I'm like, no, no, sweetie, you're doing just fine. Just keep at it. It'll it'll get smoother. It'll get smoother. <laughs> just add just add more milk. <laughs> and then, yeah, we shared like a few like tips about, I, was, I shared a few tips about cooking to her and like, um... Uh, stuff she can do and stuff about meal prep. Yeah, he keeps mashing the potatoes, working on the games. <laughs> yeah. Um, let me see what else. And then as she was doing that, eventually I was able to get to the chicken. I cooked it, and then I also cooked uh, the mushrooms and the asparagus. And then uh, what happened? I gave the mashed potatoes a taste test and I complimented her on her very good seasoning. It was just right. It was very yummy. And I, I think I think she was happy about that. <laughs> uh, you're doing fine. Can you just keep at it? Oh, ayo! Ayo! Bonk that guy! Bonk that guy! <laughs> We're talking about cooking here! <laughs> um, and then, let me see. Um... So when everything was done, we played it up, we started eating, and I was really happy because when she was eating the stuff that we cooked, she's going like, mm -hmm, and she really, really, really enjoyed it. And she was like, you know, normally, I don't really like, you know, chicken tends to be pretty bland, but you managed to get it so flavorful. And then what else? I'm like, man, these the veggies and the mushrooms are so yummy. I'm turning it into rice and I'm eating so much of it. Mm. And she actually went for seconds, guys. She normally doesn't go for seconds. So that's like a very, very, very proud moment for me. <laughs> uh, and yeah, I... You know, it just, it makes me very happy to see her enjoy the food and also just enjoy hanging out. You managed to hack her palate. Yeah, you know, I honestly worry sometimes because I, I hope I'm not like pushing her too much because I like to get her to try a lot of different things to figure out what, you know, what works for her palate, right? And so like I can like, you know, find the cheat strat and then spam it. <laughs> not spam it, but like, you know, um, and also see if like, you know, food she's never tried before actually work well for her, right? So, yeah. Second Sky, your guard of cookie. <laughs> the honest and vibe just come naturally to you, I guess. She, she, how do you say? She manages to like, 
uh what's the word elicit an onesan or mom response in me <laughs> like she started calling me mom a lot throughout the day <laughs> ah, and like this guy just wait until you show her the cheese strat and by cheese strat i mean she's great and she will never be the same to fresh grated cheese for her food oh yeah fresh grated cheese we didn't really buy any cheese maybe next time mommy <laughs> sorry mommy no just mom <laughs> um and then let's see we didn't have dessert she normally doesn't really like dessert but um thanks to the keychains who have been sending me marrows i did gift her an entire pack of nissan butter coconut cra crackers <laughs> did you show her arm um she saw the the bandage on it yeah and she's like are you are you okay is it doing all right and like and like I, I explain it to her and like how i was infected and stuff right and she's like ah wait so it looks like an infected wound okay never mind i don't want to see <laughs> is what she said um how is it now it is it is very close to like having its final layer of just like skin healing onto it excuse me so i'm very much looking forward to that yeah uh i mean that's what you get for feeding her the sh meat Wait, <laughs> I think she'll appreciate you giving the effort to broaden the list of food that she can eat. Yeah, because, you know, having a good, ha healthy, balanced diet is important. Even if, you know, um, like, you have difficulty with the taste of certain things, right? Un un un. So, it also really sucks when you have a limited diet. And, like, you know, a lot of the world doesn't really cater to that. I've, I've gone through that, right? With, like, my whole pre-diabetes thing. So, um like what do you say um i it, it it's it's rather discouraging and you know sometimes like you can get kind of depressed when dealing with it or at least in my case so if i can help her with that i would i would be happy to help her with that she's too cheap to try food on her own i think she's just nervous <laughs> to try new foods also because like you never know if something will just like taste bad right in her case yeah also, she needs to make sure not to lose the way she has one. Yeah, I'm I'm helping with that. <laughs> um, and yeah, making sure that dash meat tastes good. I noticed that very, very flavorful things, very well-seasoned things work well for her. Um, excluding stuff like soy sauce. Uh, what else? Excluding soy sauce and... Like, gravy doesn't work well for her. Um, yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Healthy balanced diet is indeed important. Yeah. Um. Let's see what else do we do we do. Oh yeah, after dinner we played a game that I bought. Um. It's it's a board game. You can play it with two people. You can play with a huge group of people. It's called Poetry for Neanderthals, and it's by the same company that made Exploding Kittens. So. Uh, the rules of that basically is you're only used to you you're only allowed to use one syllable words and um you have it's kind of like charades you have to guess what the word is but without actually saying it so you can't say you can't say the word itself and then if you make a mistake like saying a word that's two syllable syllables or more you get bonked <laughs> there is a bonk stick literally there is a bonk stick it's inflatable don't worry it doesn't hurt uh, but <laughs> i get really scared by it so um you take turns like you give the bonk stick to the guesser and then the poet has to try and you know get the other person to guess it and if they catch you saying the wrong word they bonk you and then that's a minus point it's really really fun we were laughing so much oh man that was that was crazy fun um let me see <laughs> um and like uh, how do you say this we have very different describing styles <laughs> uh, i had a friend in college that would get so nervous and trying new things she once ran away crying after taking a bite of my sweet pork bread and she came back and told me it was pretty good oh man that sounds that sounds difficult you know like good that she's trying it though you know it, it the fact that she's trying is great un, 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 un. um let me see is there anything else that we did no it's just a very very fun play date <laughs> Oh, I gave her another lap pillow <laughs> and she was like screeching. <laughs> she was screeching and nervous. She's like, you're scared. No. So I actually had to like 
um like hold her and like push her down onto my lap basically and <laughs> she kept squishing into me saying like sky you're so soft <laughs> and i'm like uh yeah <laughs> really <laughs> Uh, on one hand, sad Kiki's gone. On the other hand, ha very happy to get to see her. Yeah. Um. Just, just know that I will always try to be a very good friend to her. Un, un, un. And like, I am very happy to look out for her. I do want to be, you know, um, a constant uh, support pillar if I can for her. Mm -mm. It should have been me. I mean, that's so nice. Sky, you're so soft. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Well, my thighs are very pillowy. <laughs> anyway, um, is there anything else? I don't know, I just want to hang out with her again. Oh, and on Twitter, you should be able to see that the drawing she made on my whiteboard. Yeah, of the museum mascot. It's very cute. That is never going to be erased ever. Ever. <laughs> support pillow. <laughs> uh, emotional support pillow. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. Um, and, 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 um, oh, I was supposed to give her lemon 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 square cheesecake also for suggestion by the the keychains, but she said she already had an entire pack at home. And she's like, Sky, no, please, I I can't keep this much. I'm like, okay, at least take the Nissan butter coconut. <laughs> uh, watch her coat her whiteboard and seal it to preserve it. Oh my god. Um, oh wait, hang on. I just realized I forgot to change the, the chatting topic. Uh, Kiki date. Ooh. <laughs> oh, whoa. <laughs> um, is there anything else? I... Um, hmm. I don't know. I don't... Oh yeah, we looked at like plushies and stuff and... What else? What else did we do? Is there anything else? Um, you guys have any questions or things you would like? Um, actually, no. I think it would be best to not like bring over any more like AN related stuff to um, you know to to her life outside of it now. Yeah. Oh yeah, the butt slap. I entirely forgot. Yeah, she smacked my ass so hard. Why did she smack my ass again? Why did she smack? I don't really remember, but it happened. So. Uh, <laughs> Um, I told her she could go hard if she wanted. <laughs> um, but the thing is, she ended up aiming way higher than my actual butt. <laughs> so she basically slapped me on the lower back, kind of. Like, very close to where the butt should be. But, um, yeah. <laughs> She, you know, her hands are small, so the force is very concentrated in that one spot. Not the tailbone. She didn't, she didn't aim for the middle of my butt. She aimed for one of the cheeks, you guys. Excuse me. <laughs> and she said, like, Sky, I'm so sorry. I thought your ass was bigger. <laughs> that No, that is not part of my butt, dear Kiki. <laughs> but, yeah. Makes sense. She's very short. Um, has to work on her aim. Oh no. Wait, wait, it has to be stopped. I don't know. The conversation happened. I was like, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, let me see. What else? Is there anything else? Um, oh yeah, when she was about to go home, she was like doing some stretchies. And then, like with the stretchies, she was like making like a hand, a groping sign with her hands and stuff. And like, like my brain just immediately went like, oh, hey, looks like you're missing something. And then like, I walked up to her hands and like put my chest right in front of it. She's like, ah! <laughs> oh my God. So, um, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, yesterday I made a lot of jokes that I don't think she expected from me. Um, I am capable of like some more yabai jokes like she is. It's just that I hold back. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> uh, and like she kept saying stuff like, that came from you, not from me. <laughs> yeah, I do have a filter. Yeah, I do have a filter. Sky is hidden part. <laughs> uh, thing is, like, Sk 
stars are in the YouTube limiters? Maybe, maybe. But like, um, what was what was I about to say? What was I about to say? I don't even remember anymore. But yeah, <laughs> I mean, that was our date, and I can't wait to hang out with her again. <laughs> Okay, any last questions before we move on to the game? <laughs> Wishbone Day? Wishbone Day? We'll see that side sometime? Wishbone? Oh, Wish One Day! Ah, uh, we'll see that side. Uh, mm, I feel like Kiki just particularly brings it out in me. Yeah. <laughs> I, think, I think she just particularly brings it out in me. Yeah. Mm -mm. Un -un -un. Sky Unlimited. So it's a great fun. Oh! I feel like it comes out in collabs. Yeah, I think it just comes out in collabs, honestly. Because, like, ah, now I remember what I was going to say. Um, I do these kinds of jokes because I know that she's going to back out. <laughs> I know she's going to chicken out. So, like, I do it just to mess with her, honestly. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's how you know it's a good friendship when you can just let loose, yeah. It's great hearing you guys had such a good time. Mm, and I hope to have many, many more good time. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> um, ayan. Let me see. Is there anything else I need to say? Anything else that I did? Oh! Oh yeah, for shopping. I also looked at new phones. Because my personal phone broke. <laughs> um, basically, screen started wonking out. And it's... It's, um... Yeah, so I was looking at new phones as well. I'll probably just go with like an affordable smartphone because like I'm currently using my work phone, my iPhone, as my personal phone for now. But I think for general day-to-day -day use, um, I much prefer using a an Android. Uh, though I will admit, iPhone has proven to be useful to me and kind of convenient in some places, but very inconvenient in others. <laughs> uh, or we need to do no more <laughs> thrown and you will and I appreciate it guys but it's okay thank you it depends on what you see yeah I grew up in an Android household because my father hated iPhones <laughs> yeah um let me see so yeah I've already decided on the phone it's it's rather affordable so like um yeah I I'm not a fancy person when it comes to phones I don't care about I don't get I don't care about getting the latest stuff. I just want something that like works well, feels nice to use, and like does its job. <laughs> iPhones are overpriced for what you get, yeah. I think it's more of like a status symbol more than anything. Yeah. Ah, Androids, more to add to the lore. You prefer Androids. Mmm. <laughs> hmm. Mmm. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> uh let me see. So yeah, replace phone, replace mouse. I don't think there's anything else I really need to replace. Ah, right. One last thing that I am going to put on the throne that I would like to ask you guys for help with. And also, something I kind of want to turn into a sort of activity for you guys to help me with over on Twitter. Maybe we could do it on stream, but maybe more so on Twitter. I want to get IKEA shelves and the drill. And I am going to drill into this empty wall that I have here on the left side of my room. And I'm going to put more shelves so that I can move all of this gunpla. Ikea, <laughs> um, yeah. I want a uh, man's version of Legos. Hey, Legos are for men too, mind you. Okay. Legos are for adults. <laughs> I don't know. I just know a lot of guys who like Legos. <laughs> gunpla priorities. <laughs> Um, I already have, I already have a torpedo level, um, the little measuring thing with the, with the air bubble inside to help make sure that everything is, um, you know, level and straight. I tried using it when, um, applying the hooks on this wall to hang up my, uh, whiteboard. It's, um, it's not exactly straight, but, you know, that was my first time using a torpedo level. Um, but it's fine. I'll practice. I'll get better. You know? Do we have to worry about the drill? Nah. I know. Don't worry. I know how to use a drill. I think. I've never used one before. But I've watched many videos on how not to use them. Like that one... Was it a TikTok or is it a Vine? Of a girl using a hammer on a drill. I know not to do that. And um... 
like i know you have to add like a little tape around the area so like the paint and stuff doesn't crack when you, and then like you have to clear the area out and then add, you know put a lot of stuff to cover this thing and then <laughs> fantastic you're hired <laughs> guys i watched the ikea video on how to use the drill i'll be fine i'll be fine okay uh, uh, but anyway, remember people eating corn with the drill? I think I saw that, yeah. <laughs> Final study at more. God, man, if I were a dude, I bet you guys would be like, hell yeah, bro. And then you wouldn't doubt me. <laughs> I don't know. Just a hunch. But anyway, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Um... <laughs> So when you put a second drill and throw and to replace the first one, how would you react? Hey, I'm not going to break it. I'm not going to break it. Excuse you. I'm not going to break it. We have seen the pawn. I'll be fine. It's not like I'm going to drill into my foot or something. Oh my God. Good news is the new hole. <laughs> it's because it's you. Look. The dr drilling into a wall is not the same thing as building the hand of a gunpla, okay? It's not the same thing. I can do this. <laughs> I can do this. I want to say I'm faith in you. <laughs> I really want to. Mm. I'm gonna prove it to you guys. Mm. I'll prove it, okay? Okay, like, I can't really record doing it, but like, um, I can I can live tweet it. <laughs> Ikea stream? Oh man, maybe. Nah, probably can't. Honestly, uh, did you remember to get a stud finder? Do you know where the power lines behind the wall is? I think it should be fine. I don't think there. I don't. It's okay. Wait, this wall is just full concrete. Okay, this this is full concrete. I think it should be fine. It's not drywall, right? <laughs> okay, A stud finder. I'm guessing that's something that would like let me know what's behind the wall so that I don't drill into it, right? I did not know that you needed to do that. Okay, all right. All right, okay. Let me write that down. Let me write that down. Stud finder. Okay. Things to buy before you drill into the wall. <laughs> All right. Right? Right? Um, sometimes there's still electric lines and concrete walls. Is there anything in particular that... I need to, like, is this, is, does the stud finder also work on the electric lines? <laughs> Cardio! <laughs> <It's>, what? <laughs> Even concrete walls have tubes in them for us. I see. I actually don't know what concrete is. Please be careful, Sky. We don't need to be able to see your skeleton. Mm, I, I want shelves. I want shelves in the wall. Because the only other option then, if not drilling into the wall, is I can't I can't use adhesive hooks there. Because the stuff I want to hang could potentially get heavy. Potentially. Like putting a gajillion gunpla there might get heavy. <laughs> mm. Depends on the stud finder, but those tend to get outside budget because they're all in one type thingies. Ah you can do it, just do it safely and with proper prep. It's time to find more tutorials and maybe ask around. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Sky learning about drilling <laughs> Um aside okay, aside from adhesive stuff, another thing I could do is get like a really tall shelf type thing that has a lot of empty space on the bottom and then put it over this table that I have where my CRT is sitting. So it's kinda like hmm. I don't know. Or replace the whole thing with like a TV stand thing that has shelves up top, but it's kind of cramped and might reach into my shelf on the right. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> also, that wall is not the one shared with the bathroom. No. No, it is not. It is not. Mm -mm. Okay. <laughs> sweat, honey. If you want to jump to the wall, remember to get drill bits that are meant for concrete. Yeah. Fine china cabinet, make it into a display thing. I 
I guess. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Cause what what else would I put up on the wall aside from all the gunpla? I'm trying to think. Is there anything else that I'd put on the wall aside from gunpla? Cause aside from shelves, I also kind of want to get a pegboard. Um, you know, for like hanging things or like putting mini shelves. I think that could work with adhesive. Um, cause like stuff like that, you normally don't. Actually, no. It's like a metallic pegboard thing. You might need to drill it in. Uh, well, I'll think about it. <laughs> You've got options and a bunch of creative, obsessive engineers among the skylights. <laughs> we'll figure it out as soon as a team. Aw, thank you. I appreciate that. So, um, I'll hold off on the drill for now. <laughs> now that I've discovered that there are more things we need to do. So, um, yeah, we can talk about that another time. But in terms of engineering, why don't we go over to the game? <laughs> Um, I miss what materials or walls are, but there are various sinker type objects for materials if you aren't able to go too deep. Hmm, okay, okay. All right, a plan is forming. Sinker type objects, huh? I will also add that in. Sinker type object. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go over to the other screen now, okay? Now let's, yeah, the game, right. Okay, let's go, whoosh. Okay, we are here, and we are here to to build thing, like like engineer. <laughs> I totally did not just display how little I know about engineering. <laughs> so let me go prove it to you now that I know a lot about engineering. <laughs> okay, let's continue with um, our beloved Peabot. So um, let's go see. Um, we have classic Peabot here, and. Actually, is he working? Oh, okay, wait, yeah, we have this. How do we change channels again? Ah, Q and E, right. Um, yeah, I just wanted to make sure that everything's working. And, like, remembering the controls. So, we, um, did, <laughs> we did the, the umbrella last, right? That's what we did last. So, um... I guess we can go deliver some pizza. A lot of these other things are pretty far out. But this one is kind of close. So maybe let's, let's get the trophy. It's from the resort, so it's like, all oh, right, driving, driving hard. Okay, let's go get the trophy from here and see if we can bring it up. Oh boy. Do you guys like curvy roads for parking? Like when you go up a building and it does like that little curvy tunnel thing. Oh, that's a big trophy. Um, hang on a sec. I need to figure out how to do this. Oh, little water particle effects. That's nice. Um, we are going to need to um edit Peabot for this. So let me just delete that and then. Let's get like a hydraulic cylinder here. And then another hub. Okay. I have to drive up a windy tunnel parking structure for work on the daily. Got used to it, but hated it at first. Cause like most of the time it's pretty easy to like scratch or bump your vehicle vehicle on the side, right? In places like that. Also, you guys are gonna see my mouse freaking out a lot because of the um the thing, right? Um Wait, hang on. There. Uh, wait, why did I add two? With um, <laughs> the double clicking, yeah. Let's see. So what we want next is the these claws to work right. So we need two rotors, I think. I believe we need two rotors. Um. So. Oh wait, I'm gonna need. Aren't I gonna need another hub for this? Actually, how big does the thing need to be? Let's let's measure it real quick. Oh wait, no, we can we can just put it in the center. Yeah, we can just put it in the center. So let's edit that. Add a servo motor on the top and the bottom, like this, and then the hub can go here and here, and then we need the claw. Um, how does this work again? How do you rotate? It's been a while since I last played. Where is the rotate thing? A and D. Okay, so here and then here. 
All right, no. Oh wait, I forgot to program the stuff. Oh, yeah, I forgot to program it. Give me a sec. Um, it's this thing, right? So change this to channel two for for it to work at the same time. Oh wait, I feel like it's a little too tall. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. E you know what? We can we can try to make it work. We can try to make it work. So let's just extend this bad boy. Oh wait, he doesn't go very high, does he? Uh, it's okay. Oh, oh, it's okay. This is fine. Um. <laughs> mm, mm. Oh. Um. Hmm. Okay. All right. <laughs> let's just try that again. This entire game just reminds me of those Lego machines you build and program. Yeah. What was it called again? Um, I think it was called like Lego Storm or something. I remember having that in our computer lab back in the day, um, in like high school. Um, okay, wait, I need, I need, I need to fix this. Yeah, Mindstorm, yeah. Hmm, okay, wait, um, this is a bit of a pickle. Uh, <laughs> well, now that it's on the ground, we can kind of just like, we can just put the things on the bottom, you know, like, uh, wait, how is it looking right now again? Wait, why am I down here? Oh shit, why am I down here? Hang on, let's go back up. Oh, driving hard. Come on, come on, Peabot. Come on, Peabot, don't let gravity beat you. Come on, gravity's, gravity's your bitch, not the other way around, okay? There we go, Peabot. Very good. Oh, he is now upside down. Okay. Um, so, hmm. I think in the middle we could work with like a another claw like grip. I think, maybe. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let me think. I haven't really used stuff like the, the jaw in a while. I don't think we need to. What other stuff have we unlocked? Yeah, we've got connectors and a plate. I I, I don't even remember what that's for anymore. Um, <clears throat> so I want another claw like, I mean, crab like grip, right? So <clears throat> let me think. Um, I guess we I need I needed to jut out of the machine, of course, so like this. Actually, let's use a hydraulic cylinder. I still I feel kind of icky because my my tummy's full of soup. <laughs> I ate a lot of soup for lunch today because I tried to finish it because uh, I just had a lot of um, sopas that I made and it's been sitting there for a while um, and like. Yeah, I just I just wanted to make sure that was I could get it finished before it goes bad. What was I trying to do with this again? Right, crab like claw up and down, right? Yeah. Or maybe I can have something like a like a like a scoop on the bottom. But I have to make sure that it's not too what's the word? Uh not too low, else it's gonna hinder the vehicles vehicles uh movement okay then i'd have to move this up right mm. eh, eh, eh. there we go um then a connector forward and then okay how many claws do i have i have three i think i can buy one more right can i buy which do i have oh yeah i can buy um and then put a hub here and then put another connector over here and over here. And then some more hubs, one and two. And then maybe, yeah, the claw. Oh wait, let's use worst thing. 30 degree? Do I use? Yeah, let's use a 30 degree bend. Like this, that, and that okay looking looking decent Ooh. 
Oh, wait, no. <laughs> mm, no, I don't. Uh, hmm. Maybe I need more? Wait, these are. Oh, wait, they're not that expensive. Uh, okay, let's buy like that. I think. Is that enough? I think that should be enough. And then claw. No! <laughs> no, wait! Mmm. Maybe I should just use an, a 90. I'm gonna run out of money. I'm making bad choices. Okay, now that's too high. Uh, or maybe what a 90 degree would have just worked already. But that's the same as adding uh, just another. What's it called? Another hub. Aesthetic difference? Mmm. Because the claw. Eh. Eh. You know what? Let's try it. Why not? Give it a shot. And... Okay. And then... Let me think. Hmm... I can try... Getting the... What's it called? Wait, hang on. I gotta have enough... What's the word? These things. So... Hydraulic cylinder here, right? And then add a hub. And then maybe I can add the hydraulic cylinder down here. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe not that. Because <laughs> I'm trying to make it like a top rake part, like, like like a broom in a dustpan, right? That's what I'm trying to do here. Uh, <laughs> um, maybe a 30 degree bend, like, like, yeah, yeah. You know what? Sure, yeah. Oof. Oof. <laughs> this doesn't look very promising, but. Uh... <laughs> Wait, I don't I don't think that's gonna work very well. Cause um uh hmm. You know what? No, let's let's add a turbo motor here. And then okay, so another hub, another hub, right? Okay. And then let me just add a uh oh, finally use a connector over here. And then just to balance it out. And then, <laughs> then, then do I want to add the hydraulic cylinder? <laughs> yeah, you know what? Sure. This, wait, no, no, no. We, we can rotate it from up here, right? And then just add that claw. Okay, this, this will work. This will work. I think, I think it'll work. All right, so I just need to... Yeah, we, we have three different channels, and the servo motor should be able to... Yeah, perfect. Now I'm not really sure if I even needed that uh, extra uh, hydraulic cylinder, but you know what? Whatever. Looks cool. Okay, now let's go. I think we can do this. <laughs> okay. All right. Now, for the driving bit. Front wheels are being lifted. Are they? Are they, though? Are you sure? I don't think they are. <laughs> I hope they're not. Um, dang, this thing's a little tedious to... Maybe I should have just made a crane, honestly. There are handles. I... <laughs> I mean... Mm... God, it's, it's hard to drive here. Okay, so let's extend... Yeah, let's extend this one, right? And then let's bring it in, right? Okay, maybe I can retract this this a bit. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. That works. That works. And then where's the other servo motor? There. I think. Yeah. Um. Oh shit. <laughs> mm, yeah, maybe I should have made this thing a little bit more. Uh. Oh wait, no. This works. This works. As long as. Yeah. Let me cook, guys. Let me cook. I'm a master chef. I'm a master chef. This will this will this will be perfectly fine. Um, right? 
Where am I supposed to bring this? All the way there. So I can go down, but I feel like that would be a very bad I very bad idea. <laughs> okay. Um right. Maybe I'm maybe I'm making this a little bit too complicated for myself. What we can do is, uh, da, 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 da. Um, you know, just uh, add a. <laughs> Don't we have a sky popcorn? We have the the nom emote that that has popcorn in it, and it's just sky me eating out of a uh, skylight helmet and just has popcorn on it. Okay, so we have two of these. Um. And then, what am I trying to do again here? I'm trying to pick it up right. So if we want to make a crane, wait. I want to grab it at the center. So, oh wait, oops. I'm gonna make this less tall. So it's like one, two, and then add a connector here. Um. Ah, but then we want to be able to lift it. So. Hydraulic cylinder it is. Ah, but then this makes it rather tall. Eh, we can we can lower it, right? Ha! Ha! Ah! Excuse me. Pardon me. Alright. And then forward a bit. Then another hub. Bless you, thank you. <clears throat> thank you, thank you. Alright, so we have this here, we have that here, and then more hub. This one will be the top claw. This one will be the bottom claw. Okay, like this, like that, and then claw time. Um, there. And then this one, like that. And then program the channels to be the same. And I think this should be fine. Okay, let's... Yeah, I think this will work. Is it too... Hmm? Oof, wait. I think I should have extended a bit more forward. Urgh. Wait, no! We got... We got this. <laughs> we got this. Okay. I think I should have added more hydraulic cylinders, but this works. I think. I think as long as we're on like flat ground, we should be fine. <laughs> Wait, no, I'm bumping into the trophy. Wait, no, no, no. We're okay. We're okay. Just, I just need to traverse <laughs> past this goddamn thing in the corner. Let me go. Am I, am I driving wrong? No, I think I'm driving. Is he? He's not backwards, is he? No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> We're okay. We're okay. All right. Now let's get this goddamn. Let's get this goddamn trophy. Come on, man. Real? Are you for real? We're gonna need another... <laughs> We're gonna need another one of these... Oh my god. Come on, man. Come on, man. Really? Uh... Hmm. I can also... Do I want to try grabbing it from the... From the... From the handles? Can I set this thing down? Wait, I think I think I can set it down. Just give me give me a sec. Right? So let's let's set it down a bit. Let's um release it. Like like this. Can can I even release it? Oh god, it is stuck. It is actually stuck. Um Alright, alright. Uh maybe I should have made this more like holding a cup, now that I think about it. Yeah, maybe I should make it more like holding a cup. Wasn't that I, was, wasn't I trying to do that earlier, though? I don't remember anymore at this point. Um, yeah, we can move this. Hang on. Move that. And then... <coughs> excuse me. Um, for holding it like a cup... I have a hub there already, so let's get... Uh, but if we get two connectors, it's gonna be awfully heavy. 
whatever. Whatever. <laughs> um. Okay. So if I'm holding it. Maybe I can just make it teensy bit taller. Wait, let's measure it like this. Um, is that too tall? I think it might be a bit too tall. Okay. All right, let's remove that. Here. And f not there, no. Um, how about a how about a here and here and then this one here and here and then the claw is this wide enough maybe there and then program them to be the same channel okay this is this is the cup holder i think it should work is it too? I think, yeah, they're too far apart. Yeah, I'm gonna need to... I keep pressing the wrong button. I need to bring them a little bit closer to each other. Oh. So... Yeah, let's, let's, uh, let's move our claw closer to the middle. Oh, wait. Hang on. Wait. <laughs> wait a second. That is going to... Make them collide there in the middle. So I need to, damn, I need to, uh, like, like this. Uh, oh crap! What? Um, move that here, like something like that. <laughs> Wait, what? Somehow this doesn't feel right. Wait, aren't they going to bump into each other? Uh, 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 should be fine. <laughs> that should be fine, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, mm -mm. I, I don't want to think about it right now. Okay, let's see. Will it bump? Let's find out. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! It's definitely gonna bump. Uh <laughs> Extend one arm and not both. Is the shaft that the grip tool on hydraulic would be able to adjust it up and down? Yes. Um, hang on. I need to make a better design than this. I think I just need to bring them farther apart, honestly. Eh. Wait. Wrong button. Okay. I can do this. <laughs> I can do this. Hmm. Or is just my brain not cooperating today? Maybe that's the case. Yeah, that, that's totally it. That's, that's totally the reason why. Um. This one... No. Uh, so here. Hmm. 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 All right. Okay. Set them like this. Test it. E. You know what? That might just be enough. Is it? Is it enough? Might be enough to hold the the handles, maybe. Wait. Okay, driving, driving a little hard. It would be nice if I could get it into the handles. Okay. All right. Now change the channel. Lift it up. Okay. Oh yeah. Wait. 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 This might this might work. I just need to. Get it right. The line just right. It's too short. Is it too short? No, I don't. I don't think it's too short. Up. Oh. 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 No, it needs to be taller. <laughs> oh my god. Wait. No. 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 Let's let's, let's let's revise. Let's just let's just remove that. You know, just remove these and then just have this here, you know? Maybe, maybe this is the way. Or, oh wait, yeah, maybe I just need to extend only one, not both. I'm a silly goose. There. And then, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, okay. All right, now, now we try to get the thing. Okay, okay, we got this. We got this. Clench. Yes! And then up. Is this high enough? Nope, this is good. This is good. Okay. 
<laughs> All right, now um, I don't want to risk falling off too high, so let's go here. Yay! It worked. Ah. <laughs> wait, wait. Um, um, I probably should have kept moving. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> Peabot. Peabot. Uh. <laughs> Okay, let's um, uh, let's, let's like um, another minor adjustment to respawn. Oh wait, there's a button for that, right? Oh crap, this is gonna make it hard for me. Or maybe, maybe if it just keeps rolling. <laughs> or can I grab it from the base? This probably won't work. Um, no, actually, it might it might work. Uh, no, <laughs> there's absolutely no grip on this thing. All right, it's time to shove it. <laughs> time to shove it. Let's go. It's it's all. This is fine. This will work out, right? Yeah, it'll work out. Just oh god, wait, where are we? Where is this people? <laughs> no, he's in free fall. <laughs> ah, okay. Yeah, we're fine. Yeah, this is. Yeah, you know what? Again, simple solutions, guys. Simple solutions. Let's just go. <laughs> let's just let's just go. <laughs> Um, right, let's, let me see, can I, like, hook it from the inside of the model? Like this? Wait, no, further in. N no. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, goddammit. I feel like as long as I can hook one handle, we'll be fine. Or like this, that might work. Pinching it, pinching it at the rim. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. All right. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now let's get going. All right. <laughs> Keep it simple, silly. I'm trying. Um. Okay. Wait. <gasps> wait. Is it? Oh no. It's it's not gonna stay upright. Hang on. Oh my god. Driving is so hard. Okay. Now. Also, gravity keeps working on the robot, so gotta be careful. Uh, all right, so hydraulic cylinder down, right, and then servo. Wait, can I? Yeah, that's as far as it'll go. Servo motor, hook that, and then hydraulic cylinder back up again. Okay, let's go. Let's just slowly trudge along, and just pray that nothing bad happens. All right, cool. We're yeah, we're making it. Signal weak. Oh no, wait. Can I... Can I just... Wait, where is the nearest tower? Is that a communications tower? Let me, let me, let me just drop this thing real quick. Um... Is there a communications tower nearby here? Um... I don't... Oh, it's that one! We completely missed it! Um, alright, let's... Let's come back to this. Okay. So, communications tower... Somewhere this way. I mean, it is gravity. Well, I think gravity should just stop, you know? <laughs> I think gravity sucks and it should just stop. It has no reason to keep going like this, you know? I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, there, there's no reason as to why we need to obey the laws of gravity. Absolutely no point whatsoever. Oh, cool music. Um, can I come up here? What is this? Oh, well, whatever it is, I don't think they're done f uh, fixing it. Um, where is that tower? Okay, we still have to go up. All right. I think I also saw a person around here. Gravity is a social construct. Exactly. Like you know, if if we're not around to see each other, can we really <laughs> can we really prove that gravity is actually working on us? You know, it's like. What if I fall? What if that's just, you know, a me issue? What if that's just a skill issue, right? It's, it's just nothing to do with gravity. Gravity doesn't exist. It's stupid, silly. Okay, now let's see if we can <laughs> try and get back up. I'm trying to climb this rather steep incline. Okay. I like this music, it's cute. Yeah. It's a different track than uh, the last one. All right, I think that's the tower, so we need to go get it. Mm, yeah, it's probably just this one, right? I don't think we grabbed it. 
Sky, don't say that loud. The government might get you. Bah, the government? The government isn't real. <laughs> That's just another scare tactic that the government uses to scare us. The government isn't real. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Uh, okay, I think we're almost there. And... Boop! Okay, nice. Sky skill issue of all objects being attracted to her as much as she is dragged to mighty max. Sky the sovereign citizen. The government can't catch you on Mars. You're right. Sky the birds work for the bourgeoisie. Well, I hope they're getting paid well then, you know? <laughs> Those birds better be getting the proper pay cut or else we are going to overthrow the burgis. The burgis. <laughs> the burgis. <laughs> Sorry, I think that's a very Filipino way of calling it, right? Yeah. <laughs> the burgis. Yeah, for some reason, they call the bourgeoisie burgis here. Also, look, it's a little guy. Hi there, little guy. I'm, I'm robot. I'm gonna grab, I wanna grab you. Can I try grabbing you? No, I don't think they'll let me. All right, take care. Bye bye. I love burgers, burgies. I the any Filipino skylights in here who can explain to me why we call it burgies? It's probably just a mispronunciation, right? Um. Okay, so now we have to we have to get this sitting upright, right? Okay. Um, I might actually be able to grab it by, yeah, the, the rim. So, let's bring this back down. Go forward a bit. And then, grab this. Oh, oh, oh. Um, and then, bring it up a bit. Actually, maybe if I can just shove it onto the podium just right. It might, it might go upright. Might being the keyword. Mm. No, no, I don't think so. All right, new game plan. Um, make a crane like we did last time. Um, I think we can just use connectors for the base part here. Um, do we? Eh, yeah, and then I draw like cylinder here. And then a hub. And then don't use a connector. Mm, let's use like a three degree bend. I don't know. It's 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 a new cool part. I just want to use it. Okay, so we have that. And then do I want to use a hub? No. Uh, do I use want to use the hydraulic cylinder here? Maybe. No, wait, no, that's, that's, no, I don't think that's, hmm. Okay, yeah, just use a regular old connector. Um, okay, so we have that. And then, uh, sure, let's use the 90 degree bend. Okay, and then another hydraulic cylinder down. Like this. And then, hub. And then, servo motor one and two. And then put another hub here. Um, and hmm. Actually, what if I just use more 90 degree connectors? Yeah, 90 degree bend. Because it's quirky and cool like that. Make our robot more round. And then. Wait, I'm trying to I'm trying to make it like a downward pincer, right? I am, I am. Right. So oops. Um Yeah, we're gonna need it to We're gonna need it to come in through like this. So one here and one actually may maybe Yeah, let's manufacture it like this. There. Okay, cool. I, I think that's about right. <laughs> I think so. Um, actually, wait. Mm. Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, let, let, let's let's just roll with this. Okay. So now, extend. Ah, I forgot to program it. Yeah, I forgot to program it. Hang on a second. Um. Wait, no. I wanted to slightly. What's the word? Um, bend in towards 
the thing, right? So... I feel like I'm trying to go too crazy with my robot. What am, what am I trying to do here? I don't know anymore, guys. I am lost. <laughs> Ay okay, uh, maybe like, what am I trying to do here? I don't know. Uh, like this, and then wait a minute, huh? What, what, huh? Wait, 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 no, 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 no. What am I? What? Am, huh? Huh? Wait. Like this. Yeah, I wanted to do it like this. Okay. And then. And then. Where's the bend? Like this, right? Yeah, there we go. And then. This. And then. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That, that, that seems about right. I don't think that changed much at all, but it's fine. Okay. <laughs> Are these the same channels? Yes. Okay. When in doubt, add a hub. Exactly. So now we've got this. Let's open up this bad boy. And then... Oh. Hang on. Hang on a minute. Okay. Let's wait for it to, to calm down. Alright. Cal calm down, please. Please stop rolling around. Um... Ah, wait, no, I need to... I need to go to the right a bit more. <sighs> I need to go to the right a bit more. To the right. Yeah, there, 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 there. there. Very good, very good. Okay, now... <sighs> right. Okay, we are... We are in position. And then... Alright. Now... Close that in. Then we... It is... It... No. <laughs> no. Um, let's try to get a handle. Yeah, let's try to let's try to grab a handle for this thing. I think that should be fine, right? Yeah, one handle should be enough to drag it upwards. Maybe I just need two hydraulic cylinders on the base. Yeah, I think that's all I really need to do. Anyway, okay, put that down. Put um, pinch that in. Okay, cool. Um, but now. This isn't really... It's... No, it's not tall enough. I keep having this issue. <laughs> I keep having this issue of it not being tall enough. Hmm. Hmm. I agree. I think I am overcomplicating it too. Um. Okay. Let's... Let's start from the beginning. <laughs> um... So add a hub. Do I just want to add it? Like, where do I want to grip it from? The handle or the base of the body? I, I don't really know. Wait, I think I have an idea. Maybe first let's try to just get it standing upright. You know. Um. So if we want to try getting it to stand upright, we can. So hydraulic cylinder, right? Then this. And then... Uh, <laughs> it's gonna be a really... Kind of dumb idea. Wait, let me... Let, let me cook for a sec. Alright. And then... Another hydraulic cylinder. <laughs> um... Do I want to add a hub or do I just want to put the... Let's put the claw straight. Okay. Um... Maybe I should just use a server motor here. Ah, uh, but let's test it out. Okay. So now, let's just try to, like, lift this thing to get it standing upright. And then we can... We can build up off of that. Wait, I... My goal was kind of to try and, uh... Wait, no. Yeah, the, the extra... Hydraulic cylinder does nothing. Yeah, we need a servo motor. We, we need a servo motor. Okay. So here. And then... Here. I want to put in the middle. Uh, actually, if I'm going to do that, just do it like this. So to balance out the weight. There. 
Um, is that enough? I guess. Okay. Um, okay, so we have the hook. Now let's grab this thing. Okay. Wait! This feels like it might work! Uh, mm-hmm. No, I... Uh, I think... I think I needed more. Wait! Do I? Do I need more? No, 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 wait. This... This might work. Holy crap, this might... Oh no, I'm the one being turned upright. Oh, okay. Um... Hmm. Hmm. This is a bit of a pickle. Hmm, yes, a bit of conundrum. Hmm. Hmm, fascinating. I have locked myself inside of the trophy. Hmm, yes. Hmm. <laughs> God damn it. All right, how do I... Do I just reset? I... Wait, R is to reset, right? Yeah. Okay. I just... I just wanted to scoop it up. Please. Let me just... Let me just scoop it up normally, man. Like... <laughs> Running into it's not gonna help. So we gotta go in gently. Gently. Very, very gentle. Gentle. Yes? No. No gentle. No, no, no. <laughs> please. Please just, just cooperate with me here. Please, Mr. Mr. Trophy. Also, let me drive into you. Arr! There. Okay, now. Stand. And then a little bit. No, no. Hey, yeah. Mm. Maybe from maybe from the uh, the 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 little skinny part of the trophy. Also, does anyone know why trophies are, you know, designed like this? Why they look like a chalice or a or a goblet or what have you? Any particular reason as to why they appear like this? Oh shit! Wait, holy fuck! <laughs> Sorry! Oh my god! I did it! It's standing upright! Okay! <laughs> so you can hold them? Ah, uh, I see. Physics! Whoa, that's insane! Wait, hang on, I need to... I need to... Okay, now we need to face it. Right? Okay, now we have this. Um... Oop, oop, okay. Let me think. You know what? Maybe we can do it now here. So let's have two hydraulic cylinders here. Add a hub. Okay. And then a connector on each side like this. And then another hub. Another hub. Two claws. Just just to hold it up. That's that's all we needed to do. Uh yeah, I think that should be okay. And then... Okay, let's let's measure. Is this, like, the right distance? Is this the right distance? Uh, I needed... I needed to... Um, jut out a little bit more. So... Let's delete that. Oh, wait, no, I needed that hub. Okay, so here, right? Um, get the connector. Ah, let's get... Two... Connectors. And then... Or... Alternatively, just extend the front leg some more so that it doesn't um, come into contact with the... Um, with the <laughs> oh my god, it's so wide! So that it doesn't come into contact with the trophy itself, right? And then... Hub. Um, I don't want it too far apart, so... Maybe something like this should be fine. How long is one connector? Seems like about three to four um, hubs wide. Okay, now it's at the claws. And there. Okay, now let's measure. Yeah, that seems about right. Okay. The wide P-Bot indeed. Um, this should be good. Yeah, I think this should be. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. No, no, no. Wait, go higher? No, yeah, we need, we need, we need one more set of connectors. Wait, I need to remove the claw. Okay. All right. 
should be good. Right? Unless it's still not wide enough. Mm, no, I think this will work. Will it? A little iffy. Oh, oh! Okay, okay. All right, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. <gasps> Come on, get in. Get in. Do we drop it? I guess we drop it. Oh, wait, no, it's just. It's a, oh! We did it! Oh! Guys, it's a racetrack! Wait, all these little spectators! Wait, that's so cute! Oh my god! Racetrack completed! <gasps> wait! Ooh, that's a lot of parts! Oh, we can get a race car! Wait! Wait! Give me the race car! Where is it? Oh! Ooh! Cute! Rover Rover League Ball? Is that is that a is that a reference to something? Whoa. Look at him go. Wow. Wait, these control really well. Look! Oh, they cheer for you! Oh, that's so cute. They have little flags. Oh my god. You know what? Let's take let's take the race. Let's just take the racing car for a spin, you know? We oh 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 this is already not this is already not good. All right, wait, hang on. Oh, oh, sh <laughs> I can practice my driving here. Reference to Rocket League? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> I, mm, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely gonna need some practice. It's, it's kind of hard to figure out how often you like need to press down on the keys. Oh, oh, okay. You know what? Yeah, this is fine. We're, we're doing it. We're doing it. Started. I was trying to drive. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. Wait, one more lap. One more lap. Just, just practice. Oh, I got an achievement. What? Pole position. I can't read the. I can't read it because I have everything on uh, windowed mode, so it's a little out of the way. But cool. <laughs> the music timing. It's it's trying to cheer me on. I think. <laughs> oh man. Man, I really suck. Okay. Pole position was a super easy race game. <laughs> I see. <laughs> well, yeah, this is definitely a very easy easy racing game too. Don't get me wrong. Oh wait, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm getting used to it. Okay. All right, I'm done. Let's let's get out of here. Um nice. Okay. Now, there's more side jobs. Paint is all the way over there. Um, a chair, toolbox, rocket fin, crate of apples. Um, I think it would be nice to go get a crate of apples, but let's get these things along the way. I'll take the apples. But, um, okay, so we have to go that away. Let's take our little race car to get there. Mm -hmm. You'll be deja vu. I've just been in this place before. Hi, Man, Mars is beautiful, isn't it? Just look at that wonderful scenery. <laughs> uh, oh, snap. Do you think in the future humans will be able to terraform Mars, guys? I think it would be pretty insane, but I think humanity could do it, honestly. And the car is. Okay, the car is fine. Huh. Would you want to live on Mars, guys? I think we can get there one day. Autocar goes like super early, like in the Tari. Oh. Oop. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I need the ATV stuff to be able to get there. Let's take the buggy. All right. Yeah, the buggy is a lot better. The wheels are a lot better at handling this. I think it'd be super cool, but right now, all my favorite things are on Earth. Yeah, me too. It will become Mass Effect, bring on the hot blue aliens! I think it would be easy to just build and close habitats and terraform an entire planet. Yeah, that makes the most sense. Um, because I imagine terraforming a whole planet would probably take centuries. Uh, there we go. Mm -mm -mm. I mean, I think that's kind of what they're doing right now here in, um, uh, this game. Whee! Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> um, I think 
think we can get there around this mountain. So yeah, let's, let's travel around the mountain. I already hate the lag time in livestream chat on Earth. Why would I? <laughs> why would I live on a planet with 30 minute ping? <laughs> I mean, they'd have their own internet up there on Mars, right? I'm sure they would. As a Toho fan, Toho Eurobeat is peak. Oh, hell yeah. I used to be a fan of Toho. Um, I, I, am, I am not paying attention to my driving because I am talking to you guys. Give me a second. Okay, try to focus more on the road. Is this what it's like when you're driving and then you have somebody talking to you in the passenger seat? Is this what it's like? <laughs> Maybe each time I'm in the passenger sheet, sheet seat or like if I'm in the back, maybe I should just shut up. <laughs> Sometimes, no, don't text and drive. To be fair, yeah, I am looking at your messages also. <laughs> and I'm kind of just allowing people to roll down like this. <laughs> oh, I should have saved the ultimate vehicle blueprint. I did not save it. Anyway, let's keep going. Come on, Peabot. Oh man, distracted driving does cause majority of accidents, you're right! And going at very high speeds with a different kind of gravity here on Mars, you know? Yeah. Also, Mars is a good bit less gravity than Earth. It does feel very floaty here, so it makes sense. Maybe they tried to emulate that. Mm -mm. <laughs> Reasons to live on Mars, no taxes? I don't know about that. Where there's people, there are taxes. <laughs> Imagine if this game had like your robot health. Like if you kept, you know, running off of uh, like cliffs and stuff, you just, ah, oh, is that a tower? Oh, wait, yeah, we have a transmitter already. Okay. Yeah, so we should be fine. Yeah, let's keep going. Um, Like imagine if you kept falling, you just die. We'd be dead triple time. Yeah, I would cry for Peabot. It's okay, he, he was built for this, you know? He's, he's built to last. Go, Peabot, go, I believe in you. I wish the music would come up more often though. Cause like, a lot of the time it's just very quiet. Yeah. But it's nice to hear that there is more music in this game. Oh, 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 oh. Peabot? He's trying his best. Oh wait, wait. Oh, no, he's a Beyblade? Okay, let's reset. Let's reset. All right. <laughs> Without taxes, how could I watch it? Public library computers. Damn, you're brave. <laughs> I, now that I come to think about it, I've actually never really used computers much at the library. I've always ended up reading. Um, actually, the only time I really went to library was something in elementary, I think. Unfortunately, I didn't really get to... I'm sorry to get annoyed. Let's... Let's rebuild the... The thing. The... The, the ultimate... Um, ATV experience. Uh, we can get rid of that. Put that here. And then... It was... It was something like... Like this, right? And then... Here and here. Uh, one, two, three, four. Um, we can use the racing wheels. I think they're bigger than the. Yeah, they are. So let's use the racing wheels, right? Um, then. Do I want to use the the wing? <laughs> the wings. <laughs> Might as well. Um, wait, not there. Put it around. Here, okay, and then, um, wait, these aren't even touching the ground at this point, hang on, and then, oh, did I run out of hubs? I actually ran out of hubs! That's a first! Uh, I think we, I think we could delete one or two. Oh my god, it's connected here? Oh my god, it's connected there? Um, erm, um, idea. Uh, give me a minute. Spacer. Huh. I wonder what that does. <laughs> I wonder what that does. Half spacer. All right. Okay. Mm, let's add, yeah, the 90 degree bend. Like this. Like that. And then, um, oh, I don't have more. Uh, let's, let's just use these. 
Um, right? So like... <laughs> Wait, no, 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 no. That's, that's not going to help. That is not going to help. How about... Like... Hmm? No. <laughs> no. Uh, do I still have 90 degree? I only have one 90 degree bend. I can buy one more. Okay. Um. That's. Eh. And then. Wait, now I've run out of these. <laughs> what is the point anymore? <laughs> Hiya. Hiya. Uh, what happens if I use no wait no let's let's not go there let's let's use a spacer wait yeah let's use let's use okay so 190 degree bend here all right and then I have two okay and then one here right okay and that's where that's where the rover wheel is gonna go <laughs> it needs to be lower Wait, I, mean, I can make it lower. I can use the spacer thing. Um, how big is the spacer? Oh, that's not bad. Um, another 90 degree bend. Ah, oh, no, that's too low. Okay, let's grab the half spacer. Where is it? Oh, that's... That is really short and stubby. Okay. Put that there. And then rover wheel. You know what? It is just training wheels to like catch it if it, you know... If it falls, so should be fine. Another 90 degree bend. Okay. And then this 30 degree bend. <laughs> it's not symmetrical. I am so sad. Okay. This is fine. Right? You know what? This. Holy shit. <laughs> let's, uh, let's add another spacer. <laughs> another half spacer. Oh my god. Um Okay. And then this and then there. Um let's let's add one more spacer. Okay. There. That's that's better. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Okay. Okay. This will work. For sure, right? Why is he going backwards? Oh wait, right, right. Uh, okay, Peabot. Can we? Oh wait, sorry, I forgot to program. I forgot to program these things. Channel one, channel two. Let's make it channel one. There, there we go. Oh my god, he looks kind of like an octopus right now. Somehow, it's 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 probably just the the, the curvy bits. You know, I guess let's retract your curvy bits for a bit. <laughs> this will make it much easier, much, much easier to traverse, right? See, we're just constantly moving no matter, um, no matter how we orient the machine. <laughs> see, no matter what, just, um, my driving skill. See, this is further proof that it doesn't matter what tools you use. If you suck at it, you will suck at it. <laughs> So even though I have the Omni vehicle, the ultimate vehicle, um, the fact that I suck at driving still shines through. So um, yeah, I just I just thought I'd you know share that wisdom with you all. Oh my oh my god! There's too many rocks. What is this place? Put yourself, get yourself together, people. Yeah, the only problem with this is that steering is a bit difficult. Okay, there. Okay. Um, it's okay. We can we can get through the rocks. No biggie. <sighs> rocks like these make me wish that we had like a big stompy robot. Wait, which way is which? Peabot? Peabot? Where are we going? Which way do you want to move? Okay, let's try that again. Okay. Alright, now. Let's, let's, let's just... Not every robot can be steel haze. I mean, yeah, but you can one a girl can dream, right? <laughs> you may not like it, but this would be <laughs> peak mecha looks I can't even
even get my words out right because I can't. Wait, there's less rocks over there. Let's let's drive over that way. I I hate driving. I hate driving. <laughs> I never want to drive ever again. Ah, uh, dear lord. Okay. All right. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. Just just narrowly avoid these stupid rocks. I wonder, can you make a walkie-walkie machine? You probably can. Uh, but maybe not right now. Okay, can I get this way? Yeah, there's just a lot more mountain. Is this world purposefully designed like this so you have a hard time? <laughs> or is this like randomly generated? I've, oh my god, I have absolutely no clue. Let's, let's try that again. Okay. All right. Okay, we're 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 making. Oh my god, we're making our way. We're making we're making our way slowly but surely. <sighs> I have to be mindful of how narrow the passageways are. And it keeps turning in ways I don't want it to turn. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. Back back to the back to the regular. Let's, let's go with the basic rover. Who knows? Maybe this is all we need. Okay, let's try that again. Go, basic rover, go. Go, buggy, go. I mean, no, you're not the buggy, but you get my point. Okay. You know what? Yeah. Oh my god, why is he steering so much? Okay. No, up, 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 up. Okay. Slowly. Yeah, let's, let's just let's just tap. Tap, tap, revolution our way there, okay? Oh, oh. No, little guy. Wait, we're fine. Just reverse. Okay. Oh my god, this is so much easier. You know what? Yeah, maybe complicated machines are bad. <laughs> maybe humanity is striving... Uh, I am striving too hard. Okay, we got that. Now... Um, let's go... This away. Alright. Sky will one day learn about oversteering, right? Maybe. Is that also a real principle in uh, actual driving? <laughs> Is it? I'm just, I'm just asking for a friend. I mean, I, you know, um, yeah, yes. <laughs> also, isn't it keep it stupid simple or silly simple, not like simple stupid? Uh, um, because like you want to keep it so simple, it's practically dumb. Okay, wait, we're. Okay, I think we have to get up here. Okay. Oh, it's with a comma. I got it. Oh, shit. Wait. This is not friendly terrain. What is this? What is this? No, Peabot! No. Wait, we can't go through here. All right, find an alternate pathway. Oh, oh, we have been flipped. Wait, map. Oh, no, I do not want to... I do not want to put these down. Excuse me. Arm... Now that I'm looking at it, this is just like sheer cliff. It's gonna be really hard to get up. I can try to get up from like around there, maybe. So I guess, yeah, let's try heading that way. Yeah, let's try heading that way. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now, I just hope that there's no Grand Canyon or anything around here. Because that would really suck. I think there is. I think we've just found ourselves in one. Hang on. Let me... Let me... Let me get into it. <laughs> okay. Wow, where the hell are we? How do we... How do we get over there? What? Hmm. Okay. Alright, let's try to traverse over here. Um... There's a big old building there. I guess we could try to find out what's up there. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Um, it's getting dark. Oh, we're losing the light, boys. Oh, this is not good. I'm getting frustrated trying to traverse this. Um, wait, I am traveling farther and farther from where I want to go. Hang on. Okay, let's... Um, all right. Okay, let's keep going. This way. 
Can we get out of this pit? Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like this game is 90% driving. Oh my god. Okay, wait. Alright. Okay. There we are. And now... Wait, which which way is this thing orient oriented? There we go. Okay. Keep going that way. And... I just, I just want to be able to drive normally. Because it's kind of hard to like control how much you turn this thing, you know? Because <laughs> it's not like I have a visible wheel. I'm just pressing down on one key and it just keeps going. Okay, all right, we are... <sighs> Okay, okay, all right. <laughs> I'm going to ground! Mm. You know what? Maybe it's possible to like automate how walking works in a vehicle, right? Perhaps it is a thing that we can do. So you know what? Perhaps I will try to create a creature that can walk. <laughs> oh man, okay. All right, so I need to buy more of these bad boys. I do not have enough money for these bad boys. Can I make a vehicle? No, no, I don't. Okay, you know what? Maybe I can. Um, shit. Um, It's gonna be bipedal because I don't have enough money <laughs> to buy the things. All right, okay. Um, he is going to have a waist. So let's get the 90 degree bend. So this will be like his hip bone, right? All right, okay. And then, actually no, technically the hip bone is where should everything should rotate. So it should be something more like this, right? And then, um, 90 degree bend, right? Something like that. Okay. <laughs> this is gonna go so bad. I can feel it in my bones. Okay. So we have, we have like the knee joint thing, right? <laughs> um. Um, hydraulic cylinder. Okay. Right. So... I need these to alternate as I walk, as the character walks. Okay, and then this bad boy, we can use, like, jaws as the feet. It can extend outward, like... <laughs> um, okay. And then this should be the same channel, um, except... They should um, swap controls, right? Wait, is that right? Forward. Wait, no. There. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And then this thing, I think, should also be channel one. Except, let's also flip the controls. Is this how walking works? I don't really know. I know you have more joints to work with, but... <laughs> Let's, uh, let's, let's go test it out. All right. <laughs> Wait, he didn't, he didn't even get a chance to walk. Bro. Bro, hello? Wait, why is it rotating the middle thing? Oh my God. Wait, hang on, hang on. <laughs> okay, all right, hang on. I think we need a hub here. Cause it just it just rotates the thing in the middle. Okay, so and then again, um, right, and then okay. I mean, I can't even buy another jaw. This is this is pain. This is actual pain. Wait a minute. I had an idea. Stupid, si simple, stupid. Right? What if? 
What if... It's just wheel. <laughs> what if it's literally just wheel? You know? You can't go wrong with this, right? Except with the way the things are placed. It, it uh... <laughs> hmm. There. Whoa! Crazy. Hang on. Wait, except I can't see where I'm going. Okay. Wait, I... Oh my god, wait. Yeah, I, I need to balance these out. I, I cannot have them just like this. I cannot. Um... Okay, let's... Um, hmm. All right, let's let's just ha let's just have them both in the back here. I think that should be enough weight anyway to keep it balanced. Holy moly! Holy moly! Oh my god! Okay, go! Oh my god! <laughs> go! <laughs> go, Peabot! Oh my god! Oh my god. Mm, might be too simple, I guess. But look at him go. Look look at him go. Look at that. Has has the drive of a thousand men. Okay. Um <laughs> and the bounciness of a thousand balls. <laughs> oh my god. wait, now he's just spinning. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> It does not work, guys. No, it does not work. Oh, no. Okay. Well, I still want to try getting him to walk, though. I, I just want to see if, like, my theory of walking with these very limited parts is, you know, functions. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, let's, let's see how it works. Um, 90 degree bend. All right. Because aside from getting missions done, just, you know, doing fun stuff like this is is nice. I guess we can make him less tall. So let's just immediately put the hydraulic cylinder here and here. And then the jaw feet. Okay. All right. So let's just programming that again. Set it to one. Set it to one. Flip the controls. Um, I guess let's flip this one. Okay, I'm not sure if I'm doing this right. Wait, he, we need to lift his foot off of the ground. Also, it's still rotating the... What's it called? The, the thing in the middle. Yeah, I don't... Why are the servo motors doing that? Why- why are they doing that, actually? I don't understand. Is it because it's a connector and not... Hmm? This... These are the parts that should be moving, right? Oops. Hang on, let me- let me test this out real quick. Uh, I'm gonna need some feet for this guy. Um... Okay, I just wanna... Okay, now it's working, right? Yeah, alright. So, if you use a connector, I think it starts to make it... Um, what's the word? Um... Rotate the thing that's on the inside, right? That it's connected to first. Huh, well... Alright, let's see if, if this will work. Probably won't, but... <laughs> um... Probably won't work, but I still want to try it anyway. Okay, let's swap. Is this right? Yeah, and then swap. Okay. All right. Mm, I think rather than lifting it up off of the ground, we need... What do we need to do? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, third leg for Buzz. No, I think I think he's got it right. To be fair, yeah, he really. I think I really need hinge joints. Hmm. Uh. Whatever. <laughs> whatever. Um. How about? How about a bicycle shape? Just, just, just like a bike. 
Oh wait, no, it's gonna fall over. Yeah, because it, it needs to have a running start. <sighs> Fine, let's just. <sighs> okay. I just wanna. I just wanna get to where I wanted to go. It's it's that way. So. All right, let's let's just go. <laughs> let's just go. Oh wait, check the map. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it should be all right like this. So. Okay, head this way. Just tippy tap gently. Tippy tap gently across the field. Okay, cool. And then. Okay, now we need a bit more. Oh, okay, now that's steep. Okay, let's go. Um, yeah, it's this way. Okay. I wonder if this would be easier if I use the controller, actually. Maybe. I'm just gonna buy like a whole a whole racing setup for this. Oof. Actually, I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. Now that I'm looking at this. Maybe I'm not supposed to be here. Oof. Reset that. Am I supposed to be here? Legs don't work without knees. You're right. You're right. They probably don't. Hmm. Cause um, man, <laughs> man, I'm getting a little discouraged. Not gonna lie. <laughs> no one could stop her. Not even Mars. Well, it just might. I'm just saying. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Mm-hmm. Peabot. Wait, wait. There we go. Okay, we're driving again. Vroom vroom. Um, okay, so the area behind it is just very steep cliff, so no, I don't think we can get here um, already. I think we're, we might have to clear other areas. Unless I can create a flying, you know, robot. <laughs> I don't think this is possible. <laughs> no one will stop her other than two inch tall rocks. Guys, you saw how big this, this robot is compar in comparison to people, right? This thing is huge. These are the size of boulders. These are not, these are not two inch rocks, unless they're very tiny people. Also, I don't think there's anything in particular out here. Is there? Well, there's another communications tower. I guess we could go get that. Okay. Yeah, might as well go get the tower while we're here. Come on, Peabot. Okay. We sent Smurfs to Mars, but they're color orange. Also, speaking of space. I will be having a collab with Amora, Kokonizan, and DK. Um, and content warning. Wait, actually, I might be able to scale that. Uh, but first, get the communication tower. Here? Yeah, it's this way. And like, um, it's I, I like the influx of cute, funny space people, um, doing hilarious things for the vine, um, or for perilous work conditions. So, yeah. And, um, like, I think I've said this once before, but, <laughs> uh, how do I describe this? Wait, am I, am I going the right way? No, it's, it's this way. Um, so, like, Helldivers, Lethal Company, um, Content Warning, maybe a full, like, non-chibi version of Among Us, you know, an astronaut is not dead. You know that's the kind of character that I like, right? <laughs> Who's hosting the collab? I believe we're all... Well, I'm the one who initiated it. But I believe we're all um, streaming it, basically. Wait, am I on the right track? I am on the right track. Um, okay. Let's rewind to Helldivers. Ah, yes, Helldivers. I don't know if I want to stream that because I really can't last with that game for very long. I can only go for like... An hour max. Wait. Is this the right way? Yeah, this is the right way. Okay. In for Sky being betraying democracy for bots in hell there is no who do you take me for, huh? I fight for democracy. Is this the right way? It, it's down here. Oh, I think it's yeah, behind over there. Wait. Hang on. Let's try to get over there. Eh. Come on. Come on. Do, do, do. I thought the bots were defeated recently. Were they? They take you for a machine sympathizer. 
Wait, wait, wait. Can I actually make it up? Wait, I'm traveling backwards! Wait, no! It's this way! I'm dumb dumb! No! I do not... I do not... I do not want to... I keep screwing up my sense of direction. It ain't easy being me, you guys. It ain't easy being me. Cause like... Hmm... While I'm here, I might as well go ahead and get that transmitter, right? All right, so where is it, though? Ah, oh, crap. Um, yeah, it's around this big old thing. Wow, wait, holy crap, Peabot, you are scaling that. Maybe we can get up there. That was almost vertical incline. What the hell, dude? Okay. Ah, there it is. Where the fuck am I? Wait, looking at this? Yeah, I might be able to go around this way. So, let's go get it! Yippee! Oh, 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 oh dear. People, don't be scared. It is but a leap of faith. Oh my god, he's that. Th he is a goat. Literally. <laughs> a mountain goat. Okay, come on, Peabot. You're almost there. You're almost there, buddy. Mm, hang on. Are we there? Yeah. Oh, oh. It's okay. It's okay. You live. You live, Peabot. It's okay. You'll be all right. Go, Peabot, go. It's right there. Right there. Right there. Yay! You did it! Very good. Very good. Good, good, good job, Peabot. Okay, now let us... <laughs> Does Peabot have Skyrim horse jeans? Probably. Let's try scaling this thing. Oh my god! Bro's insane! Okay, I'm... Uh, you know what? Maybe the basic rover is good for a lot of things. Like, scaling a whole ass wall. Oh, okay, but maybe not a full curve. Uh, it's crazy how the static creates actual tension, yeah. Okay. Let's... Oh my god! What the hell, Peabot? Okay. Okay, we're almost there. A little bit more. There. Okay, because yeah, I don't want to lose connection to my to my rover. Okay. Oh, <laughs> you found the sky, yippee! Very good. Yeah, I, I've just been leaving it there recently. Okay, so now that we're here, we can actually let's try scaling this. Might as well, right? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! That's crazy. Okay. Well, um, I guess. The only climbing robot that I needed is the one that I had all along. Huh. Okay, wait, maybe let's try to climb from over here. What is this, Skyrim? Am I, I might as well be. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Now, let's scale... Yeah, let's scale this wall. <laughs> oh my god. Maybe the real climbing robot is the friends we made along the way. Ah, yes, I will use skylights as like a whole like ladder thing, basically. Mm-hmm. Oh wait, that's that's just like wait, we need a bit of an incline first to get up. And then we can scale vertically basically. So let's take this one. Okay. So let's go here. Alright, cool. Now we can head that way. Okay. And then take this little path here. Okay, so I noticed that gi giant, huge mountains are no problem for Peabot, but these tiny little rocks are, you know, they are detrimental <laughs> to me and my journey. <laughs> oh, man. Giving steppies? Hmm, I guess I need to rethink my plan then. Maybe I shouldn't use skylights as a... <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't use them as a ladder then. Ah, Peabot clears. Okay, we're almost there to the thing. Just a little bit more. All right. And what is it? What are we carrying? Is this the crate of apples? I think it is. Okay. Oops. Wait, I wasn't. I was looking too far ahead. Oh snap! Wait. That's a. Oof. Hmm. Is there any way around this little canyon? Oh, snap. I'm oversteering again. Okay. 
Uh, oh wait, there's a ramp. Are you kidding? <laughs> Is this actually how we have to get across? This this feels kind of evil. Especially for someone who's so bad at driving like myself. Time to fly. Okay, let's 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 position ourselves properly. Okay. Ready? Go, people! Go! Go, 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 go! Go! Whee! Yay! Alright, we are here. And we have this crate of apples. And I mean we have the crate lifter, so we can use that. Um alright. This is the crate carrier. And um, I think this should be good. So let's use this thing and reposition ourselves to open up for the crate. And then, okay. Wait, eh, eh. Okay, all right, oversteering again. Come on, just gotta tap, tap my way into it. Okay, tap a bit more, all right. No, I think we're lined up pretty good. Mm-hmm. Just a little bit more. A little bit more. No? Okay, let's 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 get it from the skinny side. Yeah, let's get it from the skinny side, make it easier. Okay. Alright. And there we go. Okay. Now we've lined up. Let's retract that. And then, oh, here, lift it up. Okay, nice. And now we have to pray that none of the apples come flying out. <laughs> I don't think they will. Yeah, we have to travel that way, right? So we have to get back onto the other side. All right, let's do this. Okay, Peabot. Go, 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 go. Go, Peabot, go. Go. Yippee. Oh, <laughs> the apples. Oh, no. Oh no! Yeah, we can't leave any of the apples out. Oh no! This is not good. Now we have one of the apples. <laughs> Actually, what happens if I... Ah, oh, yeah, they're all counted. Oh man, okay. All right, in that case, we have to figure out a different way of getting them across. Okay, Um. how do we reset? Yeah, hold R. Okay, so... Let's see if we can, like, get there a different way. So let me just check around this corner over here. Is there a way to get that uh, over there to that base thing? No. So, um, I think we have to add some, like, bumpers and stuff to, um, like, a lid of sorts to the, to this crate carrier. So, let's make that. Um, hmm. I guess we can have a connector here. And yeah, we can use. Oh, we already have used up the bumpers. Don't we have plates? Yeah, we do. So, um, actually, let's use a spacer. So, one spacer and then a hub. And then, um, how do we add on the plate? Oh, it has to be added like this. Oh, okay. Well, no big deal. Um, add a connector. No, let's add another spacer here. Uh, where's the spacer? Here. And then a hub here. And then... Where, where, where is it? Down here. Um, I feel like... As long as... We have like most of it covered up, it should be fine. Okay. Something like this. And then... Yeah. Something like that. And then just add one more plate up top. Yeah. That that should that should keep most of it in, I presume. Okay. <laughs> let's uh let's get the show on the road, shall we? Alright. Okay. Now 
Let's get that aligned. Close. Oh wait, I want it to be very low like this. Mm, I feel like we could have lowered it a bit more, but I think it should be enough. Do you think it's enough to keep it all in? I think it's enough to keep it all in. Um. Okay, hopefully with this, the apples don't fall out. Okay, oh, oh it's heavy, it's heavy. All right, maybe we could have gotten some bigger wheels, but let's see. Hi! Oh, oh, ah! <laughs> ah! Oh, oh, oh. No, it spilled out on the side! God damn it! God damn it! Uh, the concept was right, though. The concept was right, basically. Um, okay, now we're gonna build a cage. We are building a cage now for this thing. Um... Right, so let me let me see. All right, and then like no the thing is we won't need a cage if the lid is tighter, right? So let's just build it like one one uh one thing down like that. Actually, is that too low? Maybe you could use a half spacer just to be sure, because. Oh wait, no. Oh, we won't be able to connect it in that case. Maybe like that. And then... Uh... Where, where do I, how do I want to do this? Hmm... Okay, let's use... Spacer. And then hub. And then maybe we can actually just use connectors as like a as a crate gate like a crate thing on the top uh because yeah i don't think the apples can go through there probably i say probably because i'm not entirely sure um as for the wheels i could try using the atv wheels how big is it oh no no um in that case just remove the wheels from the front. Um, I could probably put like a, a little hub up here, then connect the wheel here. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine. Um, mm, excuse me. And then another spacer, and then. Another hub. Okay. There. And then, just to be sure, add more hubs here to like lock it all in place. Um, okay, now let's see if this'll. Holy sh. <gasps> eh! Wait, oh my god! <laughs> Wait, that's uh, kind of dangerous. Okay. Okay, wait, we got this. Okay, maybe we don't got this. Maybe I should just put the big wheels in the back. Um, wait, I know. Oh yeah, it's because it's it's heavy. That's why. Okay, yeah, we're we're a heavy boy. All right. Okay. Um, we're almost out of this little this little zone. Oh my god. What 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 else are you? What's wrong, Peabot? Wait, no, Peabot! No, 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 no! Don't do that! Peabot! Oh my god, okay. Back to basic rover mode you go. Alright, let's... <laughs> okay, let's get over. Okay. And then... Um... Okay, let's go back to the crate carrier. And, um... Yeah, we just need more counterweights. I think... As long as we add more to the back, we should be fine. I'd like to believe. Don't we have more? Oh, no, we don't have more rover wheels. So what we can do is just move these bad boys and put them all the way in the back. So it's like a, it's like them, it's like them trucks, you know? Uh. Actually, let's, let's space this out a bit more evenly. Put less weight in the front. Put more weight in the back. Um, 
Is this enough weight for the back? Um, I hope it is. I love the little crunchy sound, the clicky crunchy sound. Here, here. Uh, actually, I wanna, I wanna just use a the connector, and then another hub. Sorry, another three hubs here. Okay. And there. Now we build the little crate lid thing. I wonder, can I just use... Yeah, I can just use that. Okay. And then... Eh, eh, eh. Where is... Oh wait, no, I wanted to use a spacer, right. One spacer... Hub. Two spacer... Hub. Okay. And then... Add in the connectors to act as a crate lid. And then just in case... Add a few more hubs to the side. And... Okay, that's looking pretty good. Alright, let's try this bad boy out. Okay. He's a bit heavy, but it's all right. Okay. Now, lower that and then close it up. And now lift it up again. Okay, I think... Oh, wait, the lid's a little bit off. Let's, um, let's release it for a bit. And then drive backwards. Um, I think that's good. Okay, lift him back up. Okay, all right. Now this should work, I think. Um, that apple looks suspiciously like it's about to fall out. I don't trust it. <laughs> I do not trust it at all. Not one bit. Okay, let's try that again. All right, so a little iffy. Oh, that's very iffy. Uh, you know what? Let's risk it. It's okay. Let's risk it. It's fine. It's fine. It'll be. It'll be fine. Okay, just go, go, fight. Nice. Okay, we're through. Okay, so this does work. <laughs> Thank God it works. Okay, and then now we have to get over there. It's like a it's like a truck, but not a truck. Oof, wait, it is it is slipping. It is about to slide out of the grip. Oh god. It's okay. It's okay. Let's just, let's just make it around the bend. And <laughs> I clenched my butt on that jump. <laughs> yeah, now we just need to be careful. Emphasis on the word try. <laughs> um oh here we are. And we submit it here. Oh, thank God. It's snack time for the workers. Hello, little astronaut fellas. Bada bing, bada bang, bada bomb. Here we are. Now we have... We have bridge. Oh my God. Oh. Well, partially done bridge. I guess you need to do more things to fully complete it. New contract, steel beam. Oh boy, another steel beam. Um, wow, earned a lot of money from that. Thank you. Um... Oh, they're so cute. I I would want a plush of of this of this astronaut guy. They are very, very cute. Um Okay, so steel beam, right? Mm, I think I'm down for oh, for league ball. It's kinda of far. The steel beam is all the way back here. Where is that? Uh, okay, let's remove that. Sure, I'll accept it. Okay, so we have to go back again. Um, okay, all right. Uh, if we're gonna do that though, um, can I save this as a, can I save this? Um, save to slot, rename, um, covered crate carrier. Okay, and then let's go back to the basic rover and travel back because less gunk all over it, right? Makes it less heavy. So we just Ooh. Music. We we drive on back over I guess that's another steel factory, right? Sky put emphasis on a word that wasn't even the sentence. 
But you said try to be careful, right? <laughs> oh wait, no, you didn't. Shit. Well, you know what? That's what I was thinking. We just have to be trying to be careful. <laughs> okay, so it should be right behind this factory over here. Damn, already polluting the planet. Let's go. Uh, okay, we found another steel mill. And now I have this. How did I carry this last time? I had the peepee, -pee, right? I did have the peepee. -pee. So... Let's simply just add a rotor, a servo motor. I wait, <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> um, mm, can I just? How do I? Wanna, how do I want to do this? How do I want to do this? Um. Okay. Actually, wait. No, it should be something more like, like, like these. Um. Wait, no. Brain, is brain work? No, brain is not work. Wait. I want it to be centered in the middle, right? Erm. Um, <laughs> Erm. Um, let's just put it up here, and then servo motor here. Then. Sure, let's have a 90 degree bend. Put it over here. And then another hub. And then add a spacer. Put the thing here. And then have the claw come out right there. Okay. Cool. And now. Oh, are they? Oh, I connected it to the wrong spot. Hang on. It's supposed to go here. There we go. God, imagine you finish building a giant robot and then you connected the wrong part. That would suck so much. Okay, so put it in the hole. Nice. Just ram it straight in. Oh no, he's not heavy enough. No, be bad. We need, it. We need him to be more heavy. He's not heavy enough for the steel beam. Okay. Let's, uh, let's give him some more weight. Gotta give him chunkier wheels. Yeah, let's give him chunkier wheels. Oop. Um. So, give him some height. Like this. And then... Connectors. Actually, no, wait. No, I want him to be longer. Uh... Okay, then here, like that, and then give him the big ATV wheels. There we go. Oh wait, no, he'll be too tall now. Okay, then in that case, wait, remove this. Just give him, oops, wait, no, I needed that hub. Okay, just make this wider. There we go. There we go. Oh god. He looks like a skeleton. Okay, one, two, three, and four. That should be fine. Yeah, that should be fine, right? Yeah, and the the um, the rotor wheel thing makes it so that eh, we can just eh scoop it up from the ground wide boy does peabot even lift bro he does just you wait and see look at this right right okay no come on i know it's hard to get him to shove it in just shove it against the walls okay use use the wall as leverage to get it okay you can do this peabot peabot okay lower the thing put it in no lower peabot god fucking damn it God, <laughs> Piot. Okay, now you're in. Use the walls leverage. Keep pushing. There, that's more like it. Now you've got it. Okay, very good. <laughs> okay, Peabot has now learned to shove it against the wall. Very good. Now let's go. He's a little rusty, but he's got the spirit. Yeah, he's got this. See. Okay, now that we have this, now we just travel back. <laughs> 
keep pushing. He's trying to give birth. That's what's happening. Okay, now we drive back to the thing. <laughs> Who was I listening to? I was tabbed out. Um, science. <laughs> just, just science. Uh, <laughs> Peabot hasn't wrapped protection support. I think it's more like an extension <laughs> at this point. <laughs> Compared to the little stick on the inside, I think I think this is an extension. Oh my god! Excuse me? You want me to do what? Excuse me? That? Huh? You want me to put it across, sir? That? Um, I feel like Peabot could technically do it. We need wider wheels. But we need to we need to hold it lengthwise. Yeah, okay, so set that down, Peabot. Put put down put get get, get out of there. Peabot. Alright, let's reset the Peabot. Okay, so we need to revise this. Um I guess we could Hmm. What what do we need to do here? Um so I think having this many wheels is necessary. But we need to make them just a little bit wider. Um, How much? Okay, I think the spacers should be able to help us here. So... Okay, I bought some extra spacers. Put this much on each side. I think that should be wide enough to get us across the... Uh, beams. Let's go check real quick. Um, just to make sure. You know what? This is a very interesting problem. Like, it's very... How do you say? Creative uh, puzzle. Okay, I think it needs to be a little bit wider still. So maybe like a connector or two. Um, yeah, let's, let's go ahead and buy another connector. Um, another set. Okay, remove the wheels. Which is a really, really long boy, or a different way of doing this, and I just can't think of it, but... Okay, put that there. I wonder if there's a build limit, considering there are these little, like, you know, circular graphs, um, graph... Uh, like, I don't know what they call but yeah. Okay, I think that's wide enough? Is it wide enough? I think it is. But oh boy, driving on this is gonna be a nightmare. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it's wide enough. Oh my god, that's scary. <sighs> okay. So now we got that. Let's get out of there. Okay. Um now we have to ensure that we can get this thing working right. <laughs> um okay. So, since we have so many connectors here, right? We have lots of like spacers and stuff. Let's remove two of them and add a hub um, here and here. And then add back in the spacers, okay? Like this. Uh, okay, sorry, no, connector. Yeah, so a connector here and a connector here. Right? And then the wheels. Alright. And then from those hubs, that's where we're gonna put in, like, say... Um... Whatchamacallit? The thing? <laughs> the, the A claw. A claw that will stick into the hole. Um, on each side, basically. Um... And then... What, what am I doing next here? I think I might need, wait, no, let's use a 9 degree bend thing, and then a hub here, come on, come on, I don't know if that makes any difference, but, okay, hmm, oh wait, is this going to be wide enough for the, what's it called? the thing the, the the beams in front now that i'm looking at it, maybe not 
Mm, we can most certainly try. All right. Then... Okay, there we go. I feel like this is so close to like getting in the way of the wheels. <laughs> oh man. Okay, and then so hub, hub, um, hydraulic cylinder here. E. Mm, I feel like it needs to go wider. Yeah. Wait, let's measure it real quick. Is, is it okay? Ah, no, no, this is okay. However... Hmm... Is it okay? No, no, it needs to be wider, yeah. It needs to be just a teensy bit wider, so... Um... Let's add... Spacer here. Let's move that. And then... Okay, we've run out of spacers. <laughs> We run out of spacers. Um, do we still have the 90 degree bends? Yes. Okay. Then I want to extend it out a little bit further. Like this. Oh! Um, yeah, put two here. And then use that silly 30 degree connector thing. Oh my god. Is it touching the wheels? Yes. Um like this. There we go. A bit more of a sharp turn. Is that wide enough now? I'm gonna need a hub to measure along with another hydraulic cylinder. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's wide enough. I think. Yeah? Y yeah? Question mark? <laughs> no, I'm not so sure. Because I wanted to add a hook to the other side, right? Hmm. Yeah, this might... Yeah, this might need... Instead of this... Add, like, another hub here. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Actually, I could just move the hub here. Yeah, let's... Do I want to move the hub there? I could. Or just extend this thing out a bit more. I don't know. I am confused. Anyway. Uh, let's, uh, let's, let's, let's just roll with this. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, let's, let's just roll with this. Okay, so claw, right? Like that. Ah, wait, no. This makes it too long. So... Okay, is, is this enough to get it to fit right? Okay. Okay, alright. I didn't think about penetrating it. But, like, that's how I've been solving this since stream one. With these stupid steel beams. Thing is, though... Yeah, I need a bit more space in between to be able to penetrate it right. Or I could just try like shimmying this in on one side first and then, then I can sandwich it. Ah, uh, no, there's not enough space. Yeah, there's not enough space between the this thing here. Mm, yeah, you know what? Let's just remove that. Use another connector thing. Actually, no, sorry. Uh, a spacer and then a hub. So, one spacer. And then hub. Okay. And then... I think a little bit of difference in the length of the connector should be fine. Wait, isn't that exactly the same? Is it exactly the same? Uh, not really, no. It is a little bit wider. But I'm not sure if that really helped. <laughs> Did it help? I don't know. Anyway, put that there. Yeah, it is teeny weeny bit wider. Okay. Then, come on, mouse, cooperate with me here. Got this. And then these. 
Um, okay. And then... We can add in the claw. There. Mm, no, it's still not... You know what? You know what? Um... Let's... Maybe... Is a bumper enough? No, I don't think so. Maybe, maybe if I just use hubs. Like... Because I don't want it to be too... And all right. Is that enough? No, it's... Okay, wait. We can remove one hub. Then I think it'll be fine. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. This'll work. This'll work. Okay, wait. Is it... Is it going in? It's going in. Okay. Cool. Um... I think, like, for pushing it, this'll work. Yeah, this'll work. All right, let's... Let's just try our best. I think this is good enough. <laughs> okay. We can do this. Or not. We gotta get a little bit of a running start. Okay. All right. Now, get the wheels on the... <gasps> ah! Oof, yeah, no, we need support from both ends. Hmm... Oh god, 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 okay. Yeah, we need we need support from both ends. This is a this is a no-go. Um Okay. Alright then in that case, how about how about um um Hmm Sorry, what what connector is this? It's a 90 degree bend, right? Oop, I did not mean to put that there. Uh I want this thing to be longer. <laughs> how many half spaces do I got? How how, how expensive is this? five? All right, let's put a, put a few more. Okay, and then maybe like like this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't think this I don't think it's gonna work. No. Hmm. Then I mean I could just use a servo motor probably to like shift something around for me. Not that I really think about it. Uh, maybe I should just do that. Maybe I will just do that. You know, maybe I will. All right, maybe I will. Okay. okay. Uh, so up, so it doesn't drive on the floor, like this, and then, um, servo motor, right? Um, servo servo motor. Actually, servo motor can go up here, and then. Wait, no, no, no. Servo motor up up here. And then this thing. And then Hmm. Wait. Will this will this even help? I don't know anymore, man. I don't know anymore. <laughs> uh Man. What am I even trying to do here? Is this low enough? Is this the same level? No, it's not. I need one more. <laughs> I'm confusing myself. Okay. Uh, let's see if, if, if that'll work. It, it might. It might. It just might. Okay. What the hell? How did I knock that over? Okay, so, um... Alright, let's, um... Let's try to get this thing to a... Uh... Okay, this... This is a conundrum. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's uh... Let's, let's try to move this to the side here so we have a bit more space to work with it, right? Okay, that's pretty good. Um, reset the vehicle. Alright, now... Now we try to line it up... Like this... Right? Uh, which channel am I using currently? 
Right there, I want to use the servo motor, right? Okay. Now we can just get that there. All right, good, good. And then extend it just so that we have it locked in, right? Okay, so now that's locked in. Now servo motor can bring that inward. And now we, oh, it's working. Okay, now let's uh, lock this in on the other side. Oh, oh my God. It's a little clunky, but it works. Okay, uh, now, now we have to, oh dear. Now we have to get out of here. Um, um, hmm, <laughs> uh, we are in a pickle. Come on, Peabot. Oh no, it's because we're in slightly, um, lopsided ground. So it's not exactly working out. <sighs> oh, wait, hang on. I think we're getting a bit of leverage now. Are we? Is this working? I can't tell anymore. <laughs> I genuinely cannot tell anymore. Oh, wait, wait. Mm? No, okay, you know what? All right, here we are again. <laughs> This is, this is, this is, crab is stuck. Are we a crab? I guess we are a crab, aren't we? Oh no. Okay, let's... Okay. <laughs> wait, wait, reset, reset, reset. Oh god. Wait, no! Wait, we can't reset here. Game, stop putting me farther and farther away. Oh my god, game, please. Game, no. Bad game. Bad game. Whew. All right. But now, now it's in such a precarious spot. Oh god. Okay, it's fine. It's fine, just keep- Wait! No! 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 Holy shit. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We got this. We got this. Just, just, just push it on up. Right? Just, just push it on up. It'll be fine. It'll be fine! Oh god! Oh god! Mmm. 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 -mm. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Yes? Yes? Maybe? 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 Wait, maybe I can help myself somehow. <sighs> can I help myself somehow? Not really, no. Oh, God. I am, I am, I am doomed. I think I am legitimately doomed. Wait, we are inching forward. We are inching forward somewhere. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Holding. Holding out for hope. No. No. Okay. Now. Now we're. We're. <laughs> we're really just stuck. If I let this go, the beam disappears. There it goes. Oh no! Wait. No. It's not leaving. Okay. Um. Can I get this in any other way? Wait. Wait. No. 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 There it goes. I love this game. <laughs> eh. Okay, yeah, this this machine. We'll we'll save it for later. <laughs> okay, we'll save it for name. I'm just gonna name it. What am I gonna name it? I'm gonna name it Crabass, I guess. Okay. Now we go back to the basic rover. I'm getting tired. <laughs> I'm getting a little tired here, just a little bit. Okay. To be fair, you've already made another three months worth of clip material. Have I? Have I really? I don't know about that. <laughs> Virtual headpads, thank you. Oh my god, I can't drive. Wait, headpads later. Drive first. I can't drive. Sky can't drive. Oh god. <sighs> Man. I wonder. Actually, I have another weird idea. I normally do have a bunch of weird ideas, but I wonder if this one will work. Okay, so... First, we transport this right. Okay, so we need to make our little unicorn head again. Um, how did I build it last time? I don't even remember. 
Um, and then 90 degree bend. Actually, does it really matter if it's a 90 degree bend? No, let's just put that servo motor and then I know this is itchy. Put this back he here and then excuse me. Use the claw. Mm, excuse me. And then just give him some more weight in the back. Oh wait, yeah, I wanna remove these, right? So first hub. Ah, sorry, wait, more hubs are needed on the left and the right side. And then another connector. Make it two. And then one, two, and three. Rover wheels. One. Oops, not there. Two. Okay. And then here we are. Now let's go pick it up. What the? What the? the? Okay. Right. Now go grab it. Very nice. Okay, let's bring it back over. Now. Once we are back there, I will show you my new idea. You guys will see what it is that I have in, have in mind. Okay, uh, once, once we make it there. <sighs> Alright. And now... Now we just drive. <laughs> Give it a minute. <laughs> Give it a minute. Give it a minute. We'll, we'll be there in just a sec. Okay, now. Now, let me discuss with you the plan that I have in mind. Now, just because there are two sides doesn't mean we necessarily have to use both of them, right? Right? What if? What if? Okay, I'll put this. I'll put this. I'll put this back down, right? Okay, I'll put this back down. What if we just hook it like this? One moment. Actually, no, I can just put the servo motor here. Like this. Sideways, right? Right? Okay. Let me cook. Let me cook, guys. Okay. So, we have to just hook it in like this. And then push it upwards. Um, okay. Alright. Like, like that. Alright. We're shimming our way in. Fuck. God, driving. I hate... Hate driving. Okay, and then we can kind of use this. Oof. Okay, um, it's a little difficult. It's a little difficult. I'm not gonna lie. It's a little difficult, but with the power of perseverance, I think we can get it in. Mm -mm, mm -mm, no. Okay. Moya <laughs> da uh e. okay. okay 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 all right cool now we've got it halfway up all right nice so now now we drive across the beam all right now we drive across the beam very carefully across the beam because i think he's i think he's thin enough to do this all right so we don't need a wide boy it's okay if, we, if he's not thick he can be a skinny boy the skinny boy can ride along the side here, okay? And then, all right, okay. <laughs> I think it's working. All right, just drive very carefully. Okay, and now we can set it down gently. I think it'll work, right? It'll, it'll probably work, right? All right, it's okay if we fall a little bit. I think it might be a necessary sacrifice in order to be able to deliver this. Holy shit. <laughs> um, okay, um, it's all right. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, people, you're gonna have to drop a little bit there, buddy. You're gonna have to drop a little bit. A little bit more than that. Okay, it's so close. Please, people, just, just, just. Oh my god. Oh! 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 oh I did it! Oh, oh my god! Oh, 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 my back! 
fucking hurts. <laughs> uh, we did it. Bridge completed. All right, nice. Good job, Peabot. Okay, we earned the climber. The climber. <gasps> we can carry a turtle. Is Does that turtle have like a space suit? I think they gave the turtle, the tortoise, a space suit. Posture check? Yeah, I'm shrimping like hell. Anyway, let's see what the climber is like. Oh, little guy. No, bigger guy. Does he actually climb? No. Oh. What, what, what is it doing? Hang on. Let's, let's try it out here. It's got like vroom 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 like sound effects on it. Okay, wow, this is... Alright, okay. Seems pretty good so far. Does it actually climb vertical? Oh, oh my god! I don't know if that's climbing. Um, okay. Oh, wow! Mm, I think it needs to bump into something first and then it climbs. But it's like a bigger, chunkier version of the mini rover, I guess. Alright, well, let's uh, let's go take this bridge. <laughs> if I can just drive straight. <laughs> Peabot did a flip! Whoa! Yeah. Ah, uh, Tears of the Kingdom vehicle builds. Beautiful. I, I've seen somebody build a whole robot um, in TOTK. Yeah. Oh, music again. Okay, so now that we're here, we have discovered the spaceport, so now we can fast travel here. It doesn't seem like there's anything here just yet. There's probably another contract um, we can pick up for this place. In the meantime, let me see. What do we have? Do I feel like... Taking the turtle? Oh, the turtle's here? Oh, sure, I'll take the turtle as, as a job, bring him back. Where is he? Oh, what? It wants me to go up? It wants me to climb, right? So how does this work? Because we've got the climber thingy, right? So what if I knock into this? <gasps> Holy moly! What the hell? You're a lizard! <gasps> Whoa! Guys! That is so cool! What the hell? Okay. That, that's insane! I love this game! <laughs> that is awesome! Okay, so where's the little tortoise? Where is he? Where's the little guy? Hi there, buddy! Hi! It's me, your, your, your Uber driver! Hi! How are you doing? Does he move? Oh my god, he's alive! <gasps> he's alive! Little guy, hi! How do I carry you though? Um, how do I carry him? Like, I guess I can carry him like a crab. Um, alright, let's 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 carry him like a crab. So, um, like this. Um, hmm. Actually, wait, I want it to be like... Actually, no, no, let's put it... What is that sound going on in my right ear? I'm hearing something, like a... Is that the turtle? It might... It might be. I have no idea, but it's, it's freaking me out a little bit, not gonna lie. Huh, okay, so... This is just so, like, I can, like, move the claw up and down a bit. The servo motor there. And then... Um, we'll have a claw coming in from... I... Um, it's okay to drop him Sky Turtles of High Defense stats. I don't... Um, I don't know about that. I don't think I want to risk it. <laughs> okay, let's just add a bunch of stuff here. And then... Okay. Um... Wait, servo motor, right? Um, erm. Okay. And then servo motor up here, maybe? Um, and then a hub. And then I think I'll have a 90 degree connector here. Actually, yeah, let's keep it like, like this, right? And then... Have a claw come out. Like this, and then 
another 90 degree bend here. Um. Wait, why did I make it so tall? <laughs> why did I make it so tall? What am I doing? Um, you know what? Uh, whatever. Do I have a connector around here? Actually, I think I wanted to make it more wide, not not tall. Hang on, let's let's redo this. What am I doing? Um, right, wider, wider uh claws. So it can actually be something like this, right? And then servo motor here and here, and then have the where is it? 90 degree bend like that i think that should be okay and then oh wait sorry let's point them outwards a bit and then there and then the claws okay i think i think that should be enough to grab the turtle right um is it wide enough? Yeah, that's wide enough to grab the turtle. Um, oh, I put it on backwards! Um, I'm too lazy to rebuild it, so um, I'm just gonna have to live with me building, I mean, doing this backwards. Okay. Alright. Okay. So let's grab this little fella. Okay, little fella. Excuse me, little fella. I'm gonna be carrying you, alright? Oh, he hides in the shell. That's so cute. Wait, I should have programmed this to lift at the same time. Anyway, um... Oh, oh, sorry. Wait, I think... Yeah, let's let's reprogram this to move at the same time. This, channel 2, channel 3. Let's make a channel. Oops. Channel 2. Okay. Oh, right, I'm supposed to flip it. My bad. Okay, so... There. Um... Yeah, that's better. Okay, hi, buddy. Sorry about earlier. I... Actually, I'm gonna try grabbing you from behind, okay? <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm just gonna grab you from behind. I uh, gotta get them grippers on your shell, okay? Alright. Now, let me just see if I can remember how to drive backwards. Okay. All right. Um, I think it's working. Is it working? Um, good enough. Okay, now let's put this down. Now we grab him. Okay. And then lift him up. Oh, sorry. Actually, this makes it easier to um, carry him, I think. And then, yeah, grip it tighter. Lift him higher. Oh shit! No, 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 no! <laughs> Wait, I think I have the concept right. I think I have the concept right, at least. Um... <laughs> I feel so bad for him. He's probably like, what on earth is going on? He has no idea what's happening in, in this life. Everything's moving too fast for him. Um, okay, but here's the problem is, you know, carrying him just safely um without like dropping him like crazy i think there is no choice though we might just have to drop him at some point why is he oh <laughs> wait that's not when i wanted to drop him though sorry buddy i'm back okay all right come here i'm gonna have to yeah i'm gonna have to drop this guy <laughs> oh man okay <laughs> You will be the sacrificial tortoise. Goodbye. Yeet! <laughs> Can I get rid of the gravity stuff? Can I, like, descend from gravity? Because I kind of don't want to... I kind of don't want to be here anymore. You know? Is there a way to... I don't think so. <laughs> I'll just reset the thing. And maybe we can just try and hope that... Eh. Nope. Nope. Oh, there we go. Yeah, perfect. Okay, we're back on ground and the tortoise is there too. <laughs> okay, wait. Hang on. 
Hang on. Um, I'm driving the wrong way. Okay. <laughs> I keep forgetting it's backwards. All right. All right. All right. All right. Tortoise friend. Tortoise friend. Pick him up. Pick him up. Um, do we have the right channel? Yes. Yes, we do. Okay. Now, bring that back down. And then, pincer him. Okay. And then, lift him up. Alright, beautiful. Um, except that the... He's a bit heavy now. Why are you suddenly so heavy? What's going on? Is it because the gravity things are off? That might be the case. Actually, no, wait. Oh, wait, this is good. Can I lift him onto my back, actually? Oh, wait, yeah, there we go. We've balanced it out. Okay, very good, very good. Okay. Now, we drive across. Bring him over. All right. <laughs> He's wearing heavy armor. Ah, you're right. You are absolutely right. The fact that you can climb, you know, vertical walls with the gravity wheels is so cool. It's going to make traversing a lot of things a lot easier, I think. Mm -mm. Okay, now we gotta bring him all the way over there. What is there though? Also, I think driving backwards suits me very well because you go a lot slower. <laughs> I yeah, I think I think this thing is driving a lot slower because I'm going backwards. <laughs> it's perfect for me. I need you know in Zomboid the Sunday driver perk. I need that. Else I just keep crashing into everything. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Big brain solution. You go too fast, just go backwards, forehead. Easy. Mm -mm. Okay, almost there. Um, this is another construction site. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. I've fallen. I've fallen and can we get up? Oh, whoa, wait, that's kind of useful. Okay, all right. Um, we're kind of struggling here, it's okay. Get to the wall. Okay, I, I cannot use the wall like this when we are upside down. That is fine. It's okay. I will simply drive backwards here. All right. Okay, gotta make sure that the turtle... Okay. How do we... All right. Okay. Lift the turtle a bit more. Oh no. Are we stuck? Is the gravity screwing me over? Wait. Okay, I'm, I'm kind of trying to use the turtle, the tortoise to, like, help me get off of the ground. Ah, uh, yeah, this gravity is screwing me over. Okay, interesting. It's... I'm kind of stuck. Okay. Oh no, the tortoise! The tortoise! Okay, wait, wait, wait. This is fine, this is fine. It's okay. We can just... Okay. We can, we can get him across, no worries. Let's just open this up and then bring him back in. Right? Okay. Now, pincer him in and then lift him back up again. Oh! Okay, I think. Yeah. Like this. Okay. Now we're kind of just carrying him. I think it's because we're upside down. Yeah, it's because we're upside down. Okay, let's, let's reset the vehicle. Okay. Now, this might be easier. Right, I, I am backwards. I forgot about that. Okay. Lower it. Pincer it. Um, Get a little bit closer in. Now you can pincer... Oh. Okay. Alright, now lift. Okay. Wonderful. Okay, um... What was that? Oh, let me go check that real quick, guys. I'll be right back. Uh...
yellow. Oh my god, wait, Smoking Joe, thank you for the tip. I missed that. Uh, let me let me read that. But don't worry, it's just stuff in the living room that fell over. And it's just like a bunch of things on the table that fell over. <laughs> Everything's fine, yeah. Wait, let me open up my dashboard. What did you say, Smokey? Uno momento. Ghosts. Ooh, poltergeist. Ooh, spoopy. Potential repair funds. And also, Ado Boy, thank you for the tip earlier as well. Treat our strawberry wife to many, many foods for us. I will. I will. You can bet your bum bums that I will be treating her. And okay, wait. Let's 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 get this tortoise in. This tortoise in. And then we can like. Oh my god. Wait. We can, we can, <laughs> we can, uh, then we can, uh, sorry, brain not working. Okay, it's the tortoise. Okay. Hang on, hang on, one sec. I'm, I'm almost done here. And then we can wrap up straight. <laughs> okay, we're in. Ah, uh, so it connects to the white structures. Okay, also, tortoise has been placed. What is this thing? Is this like a terrarium, a giant terrarium? <gasps> Closure. It's what is it? A fish fish. Oh, fish? Fish? Real? Oh my god! We can get fish! Oh man, wait. I'm kind of excited to do that, but first let's let's just go. What what does the fish fetcher do? Oh that's neat! It's like a little what is that? How does this work? Let's test it out. Tele telescopic cylinder. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. It's stretchy. It's like the hydraulic one, but not hydraulic. That's crazy, bro. And then servo motor. Ah, okay, I see. So it doesn't really extend it outwards. But that's cool. Alright, so um Yeah, the fish will be in the bag. That's neat. Anyway, um we should yeah, we should wrap up here, but I just I just wanna park inside before we go do that can i can i park inside can i go inside oh um, well um <laughs> um well um oh okay yeah the wheels do help a lot is is there a way in hang on let me let me go around i don't think there is but anyway ahem so good work today everybody <laughs> good work every um let's go see Ooh, is there anybody, anybody to read into? Ochikai. Um, let me see. Refresh page. Also, I saw a lot of people in the shorts asking, what game is this? What game is this? So this game, in case this ever gets clipped or turned into a short, this game is called Mars First Logistics. It is a game where you create robots to transfer objects from one place to another. And... Each situation with varying, you know, different, um, well, elements to it can create some very interesting puzzles. And you can solve them in all sorts of different ways, as we have seen earlier today, <laughs> like uh, with, the, with the beam in particular. <laughs> so um, if you want to try it out, it's an indie game um, by, what is it? Uh, you can find it on Steam. It's rather affordable, so please go give it a try. This is not sponsored, by the way. I just thought the game was really cool so yeah go check it out all right let's go redirect also quick question did anybody raid today i'm just making sure because sometimes i have a bad tendency to forget yeah and control them poorly <laughs> this guy's case uh, shh, shh. <laughs> uh, no worries today okay good 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 so um we have a couple of people live right now however yumi the witch is doing some just chatting i would like to see if uh, she'll be going for longer. Um, let me see. Oh, she's raiding! Oh my god, she's having Smash or Pass this for, for horror monsters. Pyramid Head is in Smash. She is, she is one of my kind. She is one of my kind. All right, okay. So, let's go raid into Yumi the Witch. Save. Remember, be kind, courteous, and on topic. And congratulate her on her debut, guys. Because she did just debut with the rest of uh, V4 Mirai's Gen Lunalia. Lunalia, right? <laughs> um, so yeah, be kind, courteous, on topic. And we just say Sky Raid once. And you only need to mention us if the raider asks. And again, please congratulate Yumi the Witch. Also, if you guys like TTRPGs too, she's also really into that as well. So yeah, go give her a watch. She's cool. Okay. 
So with that said, I will see you guys on the next stream. I believe we're having one tomorrow. And um, I think it's a work stream. It's going to be spicy art stuff. So yeah, I'll see you there, okay? Otsukai desu. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye.